we are playing Undertale today. This is my first ever playthrough of Undertale. It is it is it is blind. I know very very little about it. Long ago, two races ruled over Earth: humans and monsters. One day, war broke out between the two races. They sealed the monsters underground with a magic spell, Mount Ebot, twenty one X. Legends say that those who climb the mountain never return. Oh, tripping on a vine? You just got 300? Okay. Those giant mushrooms? Cool music. Undertale with a heart. Name the fallen human. Uh, shit. I'm so bad at, uh, bad at, bad at, bad at names. Waffles. Alright, that's her name. Oh, we can't be, okay, we're, that's, okay, we're, we're just going with it. We're going with it. Waffles. We're waffles. What are your thoughts on this momentous occasion? Your neutralness? I have no strong feelings one way or the other. Hey, Flower, what's your story? Howdy, I'm Flowey. Flowey the flower. I don't like you, spooky flower. See that heart? That is your soul, the very culmination of your being. Your soul starts off weak, but can grow strong if you gain a lot of LV. What's LV stand for? Why, love, of course. Not level, love. You idiot. In this world, it's kill or be killed. Why would anyone pass up an opportunity like this? Die? Oh shit! What a terrible creature torturing such a poor innocent youth. Ah, uh, do not be afraid my child. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. Okay. So Flowey can can fuck off. That's that's what my opinion is so far. Okay, I don't trust you, cow person. The last person that tried to help me turned out to be an evil fucking flower, so I don't know about about you. Press C to read signs. Yeah, I had to do I have to press C to read the sign. Are you fucking with me? <laughs> When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. What? Stall for time, I will come to resolve the con- What? You encountered the dummy. I, I feel like a dummy. Talk. You talk to the dummy. It doesn't seem much for conversation. Toriel seems happy with you. You won. What the fuck is this game? Frog attacks you. Compliment? That's a nice frog. Frog didn't understand what you said, but was flattered anyway. <laughs> wow, Toriel, you're in. Toriel, are you Satan? I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. Oh, nice. If you have a need for anything, just call. Say hello about yourself. Call her mom. Flirt? Let's flirt with mom. Flirt. Huh? Oh. Heh heh. Ha ha ha. How adorable. I could pinch your cheek. Which one? This game's fucking weird. Okay. A whimson approached meekly. Meekly? Okay. Um. Ter what? Console. Halfway through your first word, whimson bursts into tears and runs away. Oh shit. What? What kind of millennial monsters are these? Whoa there, par partner. Who said you could push me around? Hmm? So you're asking me to move over? Okay, just for you, pumpkin. Hmm? You want me to move some more? Alrighty, how's this? Hmm? That was the wrong direction? Okay, think I got it. Was that yet? Was that helpful? Yes, it was, Spooky Rock. You fucking asshole. Spider bake sale. All proceeds go to real spiders. Let's do 7G. Some spiders crawled down and gave you a donut. <laughs> <laughs> 
What? <laughs> a room of your own. I hope you like it. Okay, I, 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 I don't know about Toriel, guys. I'm, I'm getting some real get the fuck out of here vibes from Toriel right now. So we're, we're in a monster place and we have no idea if, if Toriel is, is, is friendly or not. So the diary might let us know. Is, is Toriel a bad person? You read the passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling bonely. Yeah, Toriel's a fucking monster. Look at, look, look at this, look at this. She's even worse than I thought. When can I go home? Oh, is this gonna make her mad? What? This, this is your home now. Um, would you like to hear about this book I am reading? It is called 72 Uses for Snails. Oh God, w what happens after the first two? Okay, that's a, a tone shift. You want to leave so badly? Humph, you are just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Oh shit. Okay, I think we have to fight her, but let's try one more time. Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to this situation. Okay. This music's great. Letting me win? What? You are stronger than I thought. Listen to me, small one. Askor, do not let Askor take your soul. His plan cannot be allowed to succeed. Um, did we kill her? Is she dead? I don't want to kill her. Well, a little. Oh shit, it's Undertale. Run. Undertale's got us. Human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. Oh, hey. The old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. It's always funny. Okay, his his text scroll sound sounds like he's going, <laughs> and that's awesome. Holy shit, that's such a good use of the text scroll sound. Anyways, you're a human, right? <laughs> that's hilarious. <laughs> That's so good. Holy shit. I'm Sans. Sans the skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be a bunch of humans right now. But, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Oh, but a skeleton needs a body. Now, my brother, Papyrus, he's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. <laughs> sup, bro? You know what? You know what, sup, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't re recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at this lamp, it's really cool. Do you want to look? No. 
I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the great papyrus, will get all the things I utterly deserve. Respect, recognition. I will finally be able to join the royal guard. People will ask to be my friend. Hmm. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sand, you are not helping, you lazy bones. All you do is sit and boondoggle. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've gotten a ton of work done today. Why is ton yellow? A scar. Okay, this is this is this is my new favorite character in anything. He's fucking great with 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 with, with the I just told a bad joke and I'm laughing fucking text scroll. <laughs> Sans <laughs> You're smiling. I I am and I hate it. Sigh. Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself to the bone. Snowdrake attack. This teen comedian fights to keep a captive audience. My fave ice cereals, frosted. All right, let's laugh. You laugh at Snowdrake's pun. See, laughs. Dad was wrong. <laughs> Human, you shall not pass this area. I, the great papyrus, will stop you. Continue only if you dare. <laughs> Well, that went well. Yep. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. Ice Cap struts into view. Alright, steal. He tried to steal Ice Cap's hat, but it's not weakened enough. Help, fashion police. Oh. Oh, shit! No, I didn't want to hit him. No, I didn't want to kill him. I just wanted to weaken him a little bit. I'm so Oh, rip Ice Cap. I'm sorry. Oh, shit. I didn't know my power. Oh no, this is the real Undertale. Oh shit, I'm sorry, Ice Cap. Lesser dog appears. Lesser dog. Pet, 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 pet. All right, let's, let's go with this pet. You barely lifted your hand and Lesser dog got excited. Pant, pant. Lesser dog is barking excitedly. Okay, so Undertale is a game about petting dogs. Okay, are you a friendly snowman? Hello, I am a snowman. I want to see the world, but I cannot move. Yeah, yep, that's how it goes. If you would be so kind, traveler, please take my eyes. Take a piece of me and bring it very far away. Sure. Thank you. Good luck. You got the snowman piece. Snowman piece heals 45 HP, please take this to the end of the year. I was just gonna make a joke about how if it could have been a carrot and, and you have to make a choice throughout the game that at some point you're gonna really need that heal and you want to eat the, eat the carrot, but but you promised. That's kind of cool. Okay, so we're never we're never eating the snowman piece and we're never putting it in the box. Okay, that's what that's what I'm deciding to do right now. We're never eating it. Oh ho, the human arrives. In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you'll find this one quite shocking for you see this is the invisible electricity maze when you touch the walls of this maze this orb will administer a hearty zap sound like fun yep because the amount of fun you'll probably have is actually rather small i think <laughs> okay you can go ahead now what sans what did you do i think the human has to hold the orb oh okay Hold this, please. Okay, try now. Does... Did he fuck that up? Does it work? Okay. Okay, yeah, we have to follow it. Okay. I thought maybe they fucked that up, too. <laughs> Incredible, you slippery snail. You solved it so easily, too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It is designed by my brother Sans. You will be surely, you will surely be confounded. I know I am. 
human, I hope you're ready for. Sans, where's the puzzle? It's right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. Sans, they didn't even look at it. Whoops. I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. <laughs> what? Crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumble is easily the hardest. What? Really? Dude, that easy pre peasy word scramble? That's for baby bones. Unbelievable. Human, solve this dispute. Which is harder? Jumble, crossword, crossword. You two are weird. Crosswords are so easy. It's the same solution every time. I just fill all the boxes in with the letter Z because every time I look at a crossword, all I can do is snore. Oh! <laughs> Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti. you with determination did you see the one earlier where there was there was there was cheese on the table, and, stuck to the table? and there was a there was a mouse hole and it said knowing that one day the mouse will come out get the cheese fills you with determination now oh, it's now there's I spaghetti in a microwave the and it says knowing that one day the mouse might find a way to heat up the spaghetti <laughs> it's a note from papyrus human please enjoy the spaghetti little do you know this spaghetti is a trap designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize that you aren't progressing. Thoroughly japed? Again by the great Papyrus. Nehehe <laughs> Papyrus. It's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It's so cold, it's stuck to the table. It's an unplugged microwave. All of the settings say spaghetti. <laughs> what's, what's the lore behind the mouse? Warning, dog marriage. You read that correctly. <laughs> Ice cap appears. Jerry came too. Okay. How's it going, Jerry? Uh, ditch? You and the other monsters ditch Jerry when it looks so. <laughs> oh shit. I'm sorry, Jerry. The other monsters celebrate Jerry's disappearance. <laughs> I'm sorry, Jerry. Guys, it's cold. Does anyone care? I knew it. Fuck, Jerry's back. Jerry's so annoying. No wonder they want to ditch him. Jerry sneezes without covering its nose. Yeah, this is why we were punching you. Ice Cap's hat is loose. Steel. You tried to steal Ice Cap's hat and succeeded. It melts in your hands. So cold. Jerry! Just, Jerry, no one likes you. Oh no. What's that smell? Where's that smell? If you're a smell, identify your smell. F hmm. Here's that weird smell. It makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you. Ooh, those two look really weird together. The dogs are too suspicious of your smell. Paws off, you smelly human. That's not your husband, okay? Oh shit. You roll around in the dirt and snow. You smell like a weird puppy. Pet. You pet dog me. Wow, pet by another pup. Well, don't leave me out. Oh no. What if I killed one of them? Would that just be... Would that just be the worst thing that I've ever done? Dogs' minds have been expanded. You won. You earned 40 gold. Dogs can pet other dogs. A new world has opened up for us. Thanks, weird puppy. <laughs> Hey, it's the human. You're gonna love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Alphys. You see these tiles? Once I throw the switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impossible. You cannot walk on them. Those tiles are electric. They will let you do. Green tiles are warm tiles. You step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious. Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through if you like blood. If you smell like oranges, the fire will bite you. What the fuck? Also, if the blue tiles are next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons. Your friends do not like purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How was that? Understand? Not even a little fucking bit. Understand the explanation? Of no. Okay, I guess I'll repeat. Oh no. Br 
brown wait there are no brown tiles purple tiles smell like lemons why don't the yellow ones smell lemony um wait did i mix up green and blue the blue ones are water ones pink tiles i don't remember wait those ones don't do anything okay do you understand better now understand explanation e even even less Okay, you know what? How about you just do this puzzle on your own? I'll leave the instructions, just read them. Then when you understand it, you can throw the switch and do it at your own pace. Good luck. <laughs> that was weird. It's a legible chicken scratch. <laughs> it's a snow puff. And this is a snow puff. This, however, is a snow puff. Surprisingly, it's a snow puff. I wonder what this one's gonna be. Snow puff. Is it really a snow puff? Behold, a snow puff. Eh? There's 30G inside this. What is this? Snow puff. See, if this was Super Mario Odyssey, um, those would all be moons. <clears throat> and you'd have the animation for every single one. Oh, shit. It's the greater dog. Greater dog, um, play. Greater dog is not excited enough to play with. Greater dog is watching you intently. Uh, ignore. Greater dog inches closer. <laughs> greater dog wants some TLC. Um, TLC is petting. As you pet the dog, it sinks its entire weight into you. Well, this isn't going to go well. Your movement's slow, but you still haven't pet enough. Pet capacity is 40%. You pet decisively. Pet capacity reaches 100%. The dog flops over with its legs hanging in the air. Okay, so if I just... Okay, so that, that timing on the blue one is that you just don't even bother waiting. You don't even bother moving. Greater dog is contented. You won. 40 gold. Ah, I like you, dog. That's a nice doggo. What was Toriel, Toriel worried about? This this place is really friendly. Everyone's nice. Human, this is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold, the gauntlet of deadly terror. Oh, shit. When I say the word, it will fully activate. Cans will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. Well, what's the hold up? Hold up. What hold up? I'm I'm about to activate it now. That uh that doesn't look very activated. Sans, whose side are you on? Well, this challenge, it seems maybe too easy to feed the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I'm a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair, and my traps are expertly cooked. <laughs> But this method is too direct. No class at all. Away it goes. Phew. What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. Neh heh heh. Neh heh heh? Grillbees. This town doesn't have a mayor, but if there's ever a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish lady about <laughs> Okay, that's a good process. That's politics. Oh, how many fucking people are there to talk to in this game? Holy shit. I put out a line for some girls today. Someone told me that there are plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. I'm literally going to make out with a fish. <laughs> While monsters are mostly made of magic, human beings are mostly made of water. Humans, with their physical forms, are far stronger than us but they will never know the joy of expressing themselves through magic. They'll never get a bullet pattern birthday card. What? Oh no. We're freezing. Okay, that looks like papyrus. Human, allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Feelings like the joy of finding another pasta lover, the admiration for another's puzzle-solving skills, the desire to have a cool, smart person think you are cool. These feelings, they must be what you are feeling right now. 
I can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. After all, I am very great. I don't ever wonder what having lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not, you shall be lonely no longer. I, the great papyrus, will be your... No. No, this is all wrong. I can't be your friend. You are a human. I must capture you. Then, I can fulfill my lifelong dream. Powerful, popular, prestigious. That's Papyrus, the newest member of the DK crew. Papyrus blocks the way. Oh shit. Uh, flirt. What? F flirting? So you finally reveal your ultimate feelings? Well, well. I'm a skeleton with very high standards. Um, I can... <laughs> I can make spaghetti. I have zero redeeming qualities. I can make spaghetti. Oh no, you're meeting all my standards. I guess this means I have to go on a date with you? Let's date a little later after I capture you. Papyrus stabs marinara sauce behind his ear. Alright, what if we hit him? So you're serious, then let's see if you can handle my fabled blue attack. Fuck. What? You're blue now. That's my attack. <laughs> you're blue now. Oh shit, the music's changed. Holy fuck. Papyrus stabs MTT brand anime powder behind his ear. What? Papyrus stabs MTT brand beauty yogurt behind his ear. Papyrus shows he doesn't have ears. Behold, my special attack. Oh no. What the heck? That's my special attack. Hey, you stupid dog, do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone. Hey, what are you doing? Come back here with my special attack. Oh well, I'll just use a really cool regular attack. Papyrus is getting ready for a regular attack. Sigh, here's an absolutely normal attack. Somehow I doubt it. bone <laughs> yeah we're not oh we can what um what well huff it's clear you can't huff defeat me yeah i can see you shaking your boots Therefore I, the great Papyrus, elect to grant you pity. I will spare you, human. Now's your chance to accept my mercy. I like Papyrus. Let's accept. No hoo hoo. I can't even stop someone as weak as you. Undyne's going to be disappointed in me. I'll never join the Royal Guard and my friend Quant Quantity will remain stagnant. Oh, my friend Quantity will remain stagnant. What should you say? Let's be friends. What a loser. <laughs> Really? You want to be friends with me? Well then, I guess, I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wowee, we haven't even had our first date, and I've already managed to hit the friend zone. <laughs> I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and have that date. <laughs> so you came back to have a date with me. You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. Is it grill Grillbees? A place I like to spend a lot of time. Is it Grillbees? I think it's Grillbees. Is this speed dating? My house. <laughs> Ah, uh, okay. Ooh, it's my favorite game show. It says, stay tuned for a new program, MTT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode, don't judge me. <laughs> Where's the spaghetti? Wow, that is a tall, tall sink. Impressed? I increased the height of my sink. Now I can fit more bones under it. 
take a look see what catch that metal and canine curses <laughs> what was he just waiting for that to happen stop plaguing my life with incentive music if you finished looking around we could go in and do whatever people do when they date go inside fuck no holy shit no okay i guess we're going i guess we're gonna go fuck papyrus that book's one of my favorites advanced puzzle construction for critical minds that next book's another one of my favorites peekaboo with fluffy bunny the ending always gets me The ending always gets some. Ah, uh, peekaboo. Fuck. The internet. I'm quite popular there. Yeah, I, I, I fucking bet you are. So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start the date? Begin the date? Yes. Okay. Dating start. What? Dating start? Okay, I don't think dating means the same thing to us. Here we are on our date. I've actually never done this before, but don't worry. You can't spell prepared without several letters from my name. <laughs> I snagged an official dating rule book from the library. We're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step one, press the C key on the keyboard for dating HUD. To What the fuck? Reel it in? <laughs> Crime? Population? Egg? Dog dar? What? <laughs> I love that the Tuesday appeared first. It's like that's kind of normal. And then the other. What, what, the, what the fuck? I think we're ready for step two. Step two ask them on a date. Ahem. Human, I, the Great Papyrus, will go on a date with you. Really? Wowie, I guess that means it's time for part three. Step three, put on nice clothes to show you care. Wait a second. Wear clothing? That bandana around your head. You're wearing clothing right now. Not only that, earlier today you were also wearing clothing. No, could it be? You've wanted to date me from the very beginning. Yes. No, you planned it all. You're way better at dating than I am. No, your dating power. <laughs> nah, nah, <laughs> Don't think you've bested me yet. Tension? Okay. I, the Great Papyrus, have never been beaten at dating. I never will. I can easily keep up with you. You see, I too can wear clothes. <laughs> In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Oh no. Just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. Oh no. Oh cool dude. Okay, I read something else there that I'm not gonna say. Okay, yeah, cool dude. Nah, what do you think of my secret style? I, I love it. No, a genuine compliment. However, you don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. This date won't escalate any further unless you find my secret, but that won't happen. Move and inspect with Z. Alright, so clearly we're going here. There's no secret to my legs, just hard work and perseverance. This shirt didn't originally say cool, but I improved it. Expert tip, all clothing articles can be improved this way. Okay, what's the hat? My hat? My hat. My hat. Nehehe. <laughs> well, well then, you found my secret. I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. A present. D -d just for you. Open it. Do you know what this is? No idea. Nehehe. <laughs> That's right. You have no idea. Though this appears to be spaghetti. This ain't... <laughs> this ain't any... <laughs> Why is everything spaghetti? This ain't any plain old pasta. 
This is an artisan's work, silken spaghetti, finely aged in an oaken cask. Then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Human, it's time to end this. There's no way this can go any further. Eat it. You take a small bite. Your face reflexively scrunches up. The taste is indescribable. What a passionate expression. You must really love my cooking. And by extension, me. Maybe even more than I do. Ah, uh, erg. Oh no, what's gonna happen? Human, it's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Papyrus. I, um, boy. Is it hot in here, or is it just me? Oh, shoot. Human, I, I'm sorry. I don't like you the way you like me. Romantically, I mean. I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flirted with me, that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then, on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. But alas, I, the great Papyrus, have failed. I feel just the same as before. But instead, by dating you, I only have dr I have only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. A dark prison of passion with no escape and spaghetti. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No, wait, that's wrong. I can't fail at anything. Human, I'll help you through these trying times. I'll keep being your cool friend and act like this all never happened. After all, you are very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. Oh, so we're stuck in the friend zone? No wonder Reddit loves this game. Sans reminds me of Mandalore. So I like him. I mean, I hate him. I hate him. He's a dick. Hi, hi, Undyne. I'm here with my daily report uh, regarding that human I called you about earlier. Did I capture them? Well, well, no. I tried very hard, Undyne, but in the end, I failed. Well, what? You're going to take the human soul yourself, but Undyne, you don't have to destroy them. You see, you see. What? I understand. I'll help you in any way I can. Flexing contest? Okay, flex more. Winky smiley face. Oh god, what is he sending at me? Ring. Hello, this is Papyrus. How did I get this number? It was easy. I just dialed every number sequentially until I got yours. Nehehehe. <laughs> so, what are you wearing? I'm asking for a friend. She thought she saw you wearing a dusty tutu. Is that true? Are you wearing a dusty tutu? What will you say? Yes. So you are wearing a dusty tutu. Got it. Wink, wink. Have a nice day. Click. So he, he's, he's keeping me interested while I'm in the friend zone. What a fucking dick. close was that? One HP. It t t t totally deliberate. Intentional. Intentional. This cheese has been here so long, a magical crystal has grown around it. It's stuck to the table. 
Knowing the mouse might one day extract the cheese from the magical crystal, the mystical crystal, it fills you with determination. I'm thinking about getting into the telescope business. It's normally 50,000 G to use this premium telescope, but since I know you, you can use it for free. How's about it? Use the telescope? Yes. Seems like it's busted, Sans. Huh? You aren't satisfied? Don't worry. I'll give you a full refund. <laughs> well, what was... Why is... Oh, sh is that from... Fuck you, Sans. Ring. Hello, this is Papyrus. Remember when I asked you about clothes? Well, the friend who wanted to know, her opinion of you is very murdery. But I bet you knew that already. And because you knew that, I told her what you told me you were wearing a dusty tutu because i knew of course after such a suspicious question you would obviously change your clothes you're such a smart cookie this way you're safe and i didn't lie no betrayal anywhere being friends with everyone is easy would that have worked i know having to do all these maybe there's a faster way it's a uh, once you've seen these a couple times it's a little a little tedious Shit, I'm criticizing Undertale. Uh, I mean, it's 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 flawless. It's flawless. Um, there's nothing wrong with it. Um, it, it it's 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 really it's really heartful. And yeah, I'm I'm sorry. Seems like a regular training dummy. Do you want to beat it up? Yes, you sock the dummy. Who cares? Poor dummy. Uh oh. Oh no. Fool, you think you can hurt me? I am a ghost that lives inside a dummy. My cousin used to live inside a dummy too until you came along. When you talked to them, they thought they were in for a, a nice chat, but the things you said, horrible, shocking, unbelievable. It spooked them right out of their dummy. Human, I'll scare your soul out of your body. If you attack my vessel, you never heard me. I'm still incorporeal, you dummy. Wait, is dummy a compliment? <laughs> Mad dummy attack defense. Yes. Because there are ghosts, physical attacks will fail. Defense is just yes. <laughs> Mad dummy glares into a mirror and then turns to the same expression. Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? I don't need friends. I've got knives. Oh shit, he does. I'm out of knives. But it so really you had knife. This little bird wants to carry you across, accept the bird's offer. Okay, I assume he's gonna let me ride back. <laughs> the big music for this? Really? Do you want to play a game? Do you want to play a game? It's called Thunder snail, Thund thunder tail. The snails will race, and if you and if the yellow snail wins, you win. Press C repeatedly to encourage your snail. Oh no! What? Why? What? What are you doing, snail? What are you doing? Snail, this is the opposite of what we want. You... What do you mean I encourage him too much? All that pressure to succeed really got to her? Oh. So they're 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 millennial snails. Okay. You wanna play okay, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna encourage once. Okay, let's let, actually no encouragement at all. No encouragement at all. Okay. Alright, once. Go for it. Go snail. Go, snail. It's not working. Okay, now now the snail's on fire. Okay, what 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 if what if we 
What 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 if we just did it the whole time? Is it, will she just boost forward after being on fire? Hold on, let's try it one more time. Snail. No, that doesn't work. Maybe after you get the snail on fire, you stop. Okay, I give up. I give up. I'm sorry, snail. Uh, unhug. You don't hug Maldibug. It appreciates your respect of its boundaries. <laughs> Chased Wiggle. <sighs> really? Okay, you feel something. You're filled with, with determination. <laughs> mushroom dance, mushroom dance. Whatever could it mean? It means you've lived a life of sin. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Hoi, welcome to the Tem Shop. The bandage cell. Whoa, you got bandages? Hmm, I gotta have that bandages. But I gotta pay for for college. Her, Tem always wanted bandages. Tem buy bandages for 150. Yeah, okay. That is an interesting look on your face right now. Stick. Okay. Tem pay for college. I kind of want to pay for college to see what happens. Let's do it. What are we using money on anyway? We're paying for college. Whoa, that's a lot of months. Can Tem really accept? Okay, is Tem go to college and make you prouds? The face is left behind. You might want to come back for your face. Yep, come back for your face. Tem back from from cool leg. Tem learned many things. Learn to sell new item. Yaha. Temi armor. Armor 20 makes battles too easy. Well, at least it tells us that it's gonna do that. Really? You're gonna sell it to us after we sent you to college? Okay, well, I uh, I don't even know what to say about what just happened. Seven. Seven human souls and King Ascor will become a god. Six. That's how many we have collected thus far. All right, so that's where they went. Okay, understand? Through your seventh and final soul, this world will be transformed. First, however, as it is as customary for those who make it this far, I shall tell you the tragic tale of our people. It all started long ago. No. You know what? Screw it. Why should I tell that story when you're about to die? My god, the music! It's so good! You, you're standing in the way of everyone, everybody's hopes and dreams. You wander through the caverns attacking anyone in your path. Self-defense, please. You didn't kill them because you had to. You killed them because it was easy for you. Because it was fun for you. Do you think it was fun when I found out? Do you think it's fun when people's family members never come home? Is that fun? No. But your time's up, villain. You won't hurt anyone else. That's it then. No more running away. Here I come. Unguard. Undone tower starting. Alright, let's try challenge. Tell Undone her attacks are too easy. The bullets get back. Oh shit! Now sunlight is, is just within our reach. Undyne suplexes a huge boulder just because she can. Shit. Oh, what? Honestly, killing you now is an act of mercy. Ooh, flip one at the end. Okay, so it doesn't matter what direction it's coming from, it matters what the arrow direction is. Holy shit. Right now. Oh, we died. We died. It's over. 
team over. You cannot give up just yet. Waffles, stay determined. <laughs> I like this fight. This is cool. You were stronger than I thought. So then, this is where it ends. No. No. I won't die. Alphys, Ascor, Papyrus, everyone is counting on me to protect them. Gah! Human, in the name of everyone's hopes, everybody's hopes and dreams, I will defeat you. Undyne looks determined. No, I don't want to fight you. I don't want to fight. Pathetic. You're going to try harder than that. See how strong we are when we believe in ourselves? Oh, she's getting- her attacks are getting weaker. Nine's body is losing its shape. Hey, what's up? I was just thinking, you, me, and Undyne should all hang out sometime. Oh, this is awkward. I think you would make great pals. Let's meet up at her house later. It's a water cooler. Take a cup of water? Yes, you take a cup of water. We have a cup of water. The water evaporated from the heat. The cup evaporated too. <laughs> what? <laughs> really bright <laughs> oh my god i didn't expect you to show up so soon i haven't even, i haven't showered i'm barely dressed it's all messy and you're a dinosaur man um ha 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 yeah i'm dr alphys i was originally going to stop you but watching someone on a screen really makes you root for them so so uh now i want to help you well actually um there's just a tiny issue a long time ago, I made a robot named Metaton. Originally, I built him to be an entertainment robot. Uh, you know, like a robotic TV star or something. Anyway, I recently I decided to make him more useful. You know, just some small practical adjustments, like um, anti anti human combat features. Of of course, when I saw you coming, I immediately decided I have to remove those features. Unfortunately, I may have made a teensy mistake while doing so, and um, now he's an unstoppable killing machine with a thirst for human blood. He 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 he. But um, hopefully we won't run into him. All right then. Oh, that couldn't be him. Nah, it's just a coincidence. Did you hear something? Yeah, it's it's fine. I'm sure this is going to go well. It's probably... It's probably Papyrus. Oh, yes. Welcome, beauties. To today's quiz show! <laughs> What? Oh boy, I can already tell it's going to be a great show. Everyone give a big hand for our wonderful contestant. What's the prize for answering correctly? Uh, more questions. Right, sounds like you get it. Here's another easy one for you. Two trains, train A, what? How many flies are in this jar? Oh, are you fucking kidding? Uh... 53. Completely and utterly wrong. The quiz show continues. <laughs> what monster is this? Uh, it's a frog, isn't it? Oh, fuck you! What the fuck? Time to break out the big guns. 
in the dating simulation video game Mew Mew Kissy Cutie. What is Mew Mew's favorite food? Oh, I know this one. In the fourth chapter, everyone goes to the beach and she buys ice cream for all of her friends, but it's snail flavor and she's the only one who wants it. It's one of my favorite parts in the game because it's actually a very powerful message about friendship. And. Alphys, Alphys, Alphys. You aren't helping our contestant, are you? Ooh, you should have told me. I'll ask a question. You'll be sure to know the answer to. Who does Alphys have a crush on? Uh, the human. <laughs> Seriously? My, my, how conceited can you get? I love it. An incredible invention. When not in use, this bed folds into an extremely easy to draw box. <laughs> Alfie's updated status. Just realized I didn't watch Undyne fight the human. Oh no. Uh, Sundier plane gets in the way, not on purpose or anything. <laughs> Flirt, you tell Sundier plane it has an impressive wingspan. Huh? You, you sicko? It's not like, I, like I'm flying for you or anything. I wonder how many people in chat are... are Hating how that I'm saying sun deer. Okay, seriously, I, I wish I could see chat so I could talk about this because this isn't something that's that's spoiler or conjecture or anything. This is one of the best soundtracks in a game that I've that, that I've, I've enjoyed for quite a while. This 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 fucking almost every track is a banger. Holy crap, the music is so good. Ring. Hey hey, it's kind of dark in there, isn't it? Don't worry. I'll hack into the light system and brighten it up. Oh. Oh no. <laughs> oh shit. Okay, cooking with Metaton. Welcome, beauties, to the Underground's premier cooking show. Cooking with a killer robot. Preheat your ovens because we've got a very special recipe for you today. Is it cooked human? We're going to be making a cake. My lovely assistant here will gather the ingredients. Oh my, wait a magnificent moment. How could I forget? We're missing the most important ingredient. The blood of a human. A human soul. Hmm? Ring. Hello, I'm kind of in the middle of something here. Wait, wait, wait a second. Couldn't you make a... Couldn't you use a... Couldn't you make a substitution in the recipe? A substitution? You mean use a different non-human ingredient? Why? Um, what if someone's... Vegan? <laughs> vegan. <laughs> That's a... <laughs> I have to have an option right here. MTT brand always convenient human soul flavor substitute. A can of which is just over on that counter. By the way, our show runs on a strict schedule. If you can't get the can in the next one minute, we'll just have to go back to the original plan. So better start climbing, beautiful. Ring. Oh no, there's not enough time to climb up. So fortunately, I might have a plan. When I was upgrading your phone, I added a few features. You see that huge button that says Jetpack? Watch this. What? What? There, you should have just enough fuel to reach the top. Now, get up there. Is the timer a pizza? This game just got very strange. And it was already pretty strange. My my, it seems you've bested me, but only because you had the help of the brilliant Dr. Alphys. Oh, I love to think of what would, ha would have happened to you without her. Well, toodles. Oh, that's ominous. Oh yes, about the substitution. Haven't you ever seen a cooking show before? I already baked the cake ahead of time, so forget it. With, with what human soul? Alphys posted a picture, dinner with the girlfriend. It's a picture of a cat girl figuring next to a bowl of instant noodles. Oh, okay. So that's why 410 likes this game so much. Can't take it. Armor too hot. Oh, <gasps> much better. I just looks bothered by something. <laughs> Dude, I can't, I can't take this anymore. 
not like this. Like, O2, I like, I like, like you, bro. Can love bloom in Hotland. Do you want to get some ice cream after this? Sure, dude. Haha. <laughs> oh, one and O2 are looking at each other happily. All right. Um, so time to kill them, right? Yep, time to kill them. Oh no, okay, what's, what is it this time? Ring, okay, I'm back. Another dark room, huh? Don't worry, my, my hacking skills have got things covered. MTT news, are you serious? Oh yes, good evening beauties and, and gentle beauties. Brave correspondent, please find something newsworthy to report. Our, our 10 wonderful viewers are waiting for it. Basketball's a blast, isn't it, darling? Too bad you can't play with these balls. What? They they are MTV brand fashion basketballs. Oh, okay, for wearing, not for playing. As per journalistic standards, a death force field surrounds the area of intrigue. <laughs> oh no, that movie script. How that get there? It's a super juicy sneak preview of my latest guaranteed not to not not to bomb film. Might have time the movie. Uh, 20, 28? Yeah, twenty eight. Starting, starting meta time. I've heard that like the other films, it consists mostly of a single four-hour shot of rose petals showering on my wrist-cloning <laughs> body. Ooh, but that's not confirmed. You wouldn't cough, spoil my movie for everyone with a personal story, would you? Report this one. Look more. Phew, that was close. You almost gave me a bunch of free advertisements. <laughs> Okay, let's do the movie scripts. Let's not keep them waiting. Let's open it up and get the scoop. Oh, what's that inside the script? That ticking sound? That lit fuse? Oh my, looks like I was wrong about the movie. We definitely have a box office bomb on our hands and it's about to blast you to bits. But don't get too excited. You haven't even seen the rest of the room yet. Oh my. It seems everything in this area is actually a bomb. That dog's a bomb. <laughs> <laughs> the tail lights on fire. <laughs> oh shit, that's good. That's good. Even my words are bombs. Brave correspondent, if you don't defuse all the bombs, this big bomb will blow you the smithereens in two minutes. Then you won't be reporting live any longer. Ring. The don't worry. I installed the bomb diffusing program on your phone. Of course you did. Use the diffuse option when the bomb is in the diffuse zone. And now, get him. Extremely agile glass of water. Okay, where's the movie script? Well done, darling. Or did we do the- Oh, we did the movie script. You de deactivated all the bombs. If you didn't deactivate them, the big bomb would have exploded in two minutes. Now it won't explode in two minutes. Instead, it'll explode in two seconds. Goodbye, darling. Ah, it seems the bomb isn't going off. Ring. That's- th that's because while you are monologuing, I- I f f fix I uh, change. Oh no, you deactivated the bomb with your hacking skills. Yeah, that's what I did. It looks like some sort of powerful bracelet. Wait, it's just a croissant. <laughs> Ring. Hey, this um, doesn't have anything to do with guiding you, but um, hey, would you want to watch a human TV show together sometime? It's called um, Mew Mew Kissy Cutie. No. Sure. Really? It's so good. It's um my favorite show. It's all about this human girl named Mew Mew. The humans don't have, so she's all sensitive about them. But like eventually, she realizes that her ears don't matter. That her friends like her despite the ears. It's really moving. Whoops. Spoilers. Also, this sounds weird, but she has the power to control the minds of anyone she kisses. But she kisses people and the controls them to fix her problems. She don't remember anything after the kiss. I mean, but if she misses the kiss, then then uh um and uh, I also I mean of course eventually she realizes that controlling people. Okay, well I almost spoiled the whole show, but um I think you'd really like it. So it's like Mario Odyssey. Uh ha ha ha. Did you hear what they just said? They said a human wearing a striped shirt will come through. I heard that they hate spiders. 
I heard. That they're awfully stingy with their money. Oh, ho, ho, ho. You think your taste is too refined for our pastries, don't you? I bought one. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I disagree with that notion. I think your taste is exactly what this next batch needs. Oh, shit. Muffet traps you. You struggle to escape the web. Muffet is so amused by your antics that she gives you a discount. <laughs> Muffet pours you a cup of spiders. Ooh, it's not good. You struggle to escape the web. Nothing happened. Okay, so that's done. Okay, so I think we have to attack. Oh, how rude of me. I almost forgot to introduce you to my pet. If it's breakfast time, isn't it? Have fun, you two. What? with the other spiders. Oh, my pet. Looks like it's time for dessert. Huh? A telegram from the spiders in the ruins. What? They're saying that they saw you and you helped donate to their cause. Oh my, this has all been a big, mis been a big misunderstanding. I thought you were someone that hated spiders. The person who asked for that soul, they must have sent a, meant a different human in a striped shirt. Sorry for all the trouble, Ahu. I'll make it up to you. You can come back here anytime and for no charge at all. I'll wrap you up and let you play with my pet again. Oh, hoo, 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 just kidding. I'll spare you now. How many choices are in this game? I really, I really want to. I think I could play this another two times and, and do different things and see how the game reacts. That's really cool. Oh, that human. <laughs> could it be? <laughs> what the ch hey, it's the opera scene for Final Fantasy VI. It is. It's the opera scene for Final Fantasy VI. Live far apart. If I was a real streamer, I would sing this. They'll put you... Does this hurt? No. In the dungeon. Oh, shit. It'll suck. <laughs> and then you'll die a lot. <laughs> You're gonna die. Cry, cry, cry. Yep, that sounds exactly like Final Fantasy VI in the background right now. So sad it's happening. Oh no, whatever shall I do? My love has been cast away into the dungeon. A dungeon with a puzzle so dastardly, my paramour will surely perish. Oh, heavens have mercy, the horrible... <laughs> Oh shit. Oh, and you'll be you better hurry because if you don't get through in 30 seconds, you'll be incinerated by these jets of fire. Ha 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 ha. My poor love, I'm so filled with grief, I can't stop laughing. Good luck, darling. I have no idea what I'm doing. What? Ooh, I'm so sorry. It looks like you're out of time. Oh, no. Here come the flames, darling. They're closing in. Getting closer, oh my. Any minute now. Robotic cough. Ring. Watch out. I'll save you. I'm hacking into the firewall right now. <laughs> He hacked into the firewall. Oh no, how could this happen? Foiled again by the brilliant Dr. Alphys. Did you forget what the green tiles do? They make a sound, then you have to fight a monster. Well, darling, that monster is me. Go to this phone's act menu and press it. Your phone's act menu is, is glowing. Yellow. You press the yellow button. The phone is resonating with Metaton's presence. Oh, that yellow glow. What? Now press Z.
Ooh, ooh, you've defeated me. How can this be? You are stronger than I thought, etc. <laughs> Is 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 Alpha is the robot still in control of Alphys and this was just some grand ploy for Alphys to look useful by being able to defeat the robot at every turn for you? What what's going on here with this robot guy and Alphys, man? Hey. Let me tell you a story. So I'm a sentry in Snowden Forest, right? I sit up there and watch for humans. It's kind of boring. Fortunately, deep in the forest, there's this huge locked door, and it's perfect for practicing knock-knock jokes. So one day, I'm knocking him out, like usual. <laughs> I knock on the door and say, knock, knock. And suddenly, from the other side, I hear a woman's voice. Who is there? So, naturally, I respond, dishes. Dishes who? Dishes a very bad joke. <laughs> and then she just howls with laughter, like it's the best joke she's heard in a hundred years. So I keep them coming, and she keeps laughing. She's the best audience I've ever had. Then, after a dozen of them, she knocks and says, Knock, knock. And I say, who's there? Old lady. Old lady who? Oh, I did not know you could... <laughs> I did not know you could yodel. One day, though, I noticed she wasn't laughing very much. I asked her what was up. Then she told me something strange. If a human ever comes through this door, could you please, please promise something? Watch over them and protect them, will you not? Now, I hate making promises, and this woman, I don't even know her name, but someone who sincerely likes bad jokes has an integrity you can't say no to. Haven't I done a great job protecting you? I mean, look at yourself. You haven't died a single time. Well, as I came in, I realized I forgot to make a reservation, but I didn't want to look like I messed up, so I kept walking in anyway. Now I'm just kind of consuming dew off this ficus. <laughs> The stuff inside is like totally wicked expensive, but like this stuff we found is like totally wicked cheap. You should like totally wicked buy all of it, totally wicked buy all of it. I mean, like where does anyone get guns or food or we found it in the garbage. <gasps> it's good garbage. It's like really good garbage. Where do we get the garbage? Like the garbage store, duh waterfall mostly I found a gun in a dumpster <laughs> about Ascor oh my god he's a total goober he's a big fuzzy goofball like I love that guy he's like so nice god we're like god so hyped for the destruction of humanity <laughs> oh shit all right I kind of want the empty gun but we can't afford it because we sent one of the fucking guys to college what were we thinking? What were we thinking? Welcome to IMTT Brand Burger Emporium, home of the Glam Burger. Can I take your order? Sparkle up your day, TM. I'm sorry, haha, it's against the rules to talk to customers who haven't bought anything. All right, um, let's get some star fate. Okay, holy shit, what the fuck? So I wanted to be an actor. Oh shit, okay, here we go. Life advice. I'm getting on, and it's like some Ren and Stimpy shit right now. Like that time those two chicks asked me to sneak them some glam burgers, and I, naive teenager that I was, said yes to them. Bad idea. So I went out to the alley to see those two ladies and, uh, you know, see what happened next. Then my boss uh, saw me and asked me what I was doing. I was so startled, the hamburgers in my pockets tumbled out onto the ground. There was spaghetti everywhere. Not wanting to lose face, I scrambled to pick them up, but... As I was leaning over, the weight of the remaining hamburgers caused my pants to fall down. Then the girls laughed at me. Everyone calls me Burger Pants now. Why would you tell me that? Holy shit, Metaton. When I first came to Hotland, it was my dream to work with Metaton. Well, be careful what you wish for, little buddy. Why is Metaton's bad? God, have you even looked around? This place is a labyrinth of bad choices. And every time we try to change something for the better, he vetoes it and says, that's not how they do it on the surface. Oh, right. Humans are always eating hamburgers made of sequins and glue? Sequins and glue? Why else is MTT bad? Why do people find him so attractive? He's literally just a freaking rectangle. <laughs> Hush puppy heal 65 HP. This wonderful spell will stop a dog from casting magic. 
Okay, this guy's awesome. Who who hired him to be the janitor? He's dripping slime. He's, he's gonna be here forever. He's caught in infinite loops. He, yeah, he does seem busy. I wonder why. Holy crap. That This is a hellish existence. Maybe we should give the soul over so they can get out. Oh yes, there you are, darling. It's time to have our little showdown. It's time to finally stop the mal malfunctioning robot. Not malfunction, reprogramming, get real. This was all just a big show, an act. Alphys has been playing you for a fool the whole time. As she watched you on the screen, she grew attached to your adventure. She desperately wanted to be a part of it, so she decided to insert herself into your story. She reactivated puzzles, she disabled elevators, she enlisted me to torment you. Also, she could save you from dangers that didn't exist. Also, you would think she was the, she's the great person. That she's not. And now, it's time for her finest hour. At this very moment, Alphys is waiting outside the room. During our battle, she will interrupt. She will pretend to deactivate me, saving you one final time. Finally, she'll be the hero heroine of your adventure. You'll regard her so highly, she'll even be able to convince you not to leave. Or not. You see, I've had enough of this pr predictable charade. Charade? Charade. I have no desire to harm humans. Far from it, actually. My only desire is to entertain. After all, the audience deserves a good show, don't they? And what's a good show without a plot twist? Hey, hey, hey. Well, what's that going on? So, is he lying, or did I did I call it earlier that, that that's what Alphys is doing? Did the door just lock itself? Sorry, folks. The old program's been cancelled, but we've got a final finale that will drive you wild. Real drama, real action, real bloodshed on our new show, Attack of the Killer Robot. Metaton attacks. Tell. That work is peachy or won't work on me, darling. Don't you understand what acting is? <laughs> then using your soul, I'll cross through the barrier and become the star I've always dreamed of being. Hundreds, thousands, no, millions of humans will watch me. They already have. Not a ton. They already have. If you, you can, can turn him around, um, and um, press the, the switch, he'll be, um, he'll be vulnerable. You tell him that there's a mirror behind him. Ooh, a mirror? Right, I have to look perfect for our grand finale. Hmm, I don't see it. Where is it? That's it? Did you just flip my switch? <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> what? Oh, my. If you flip my switch, that can only mean one thing. You're desperate for the premiere of my new body. How rude. Lucky for you, I've been aching to show this off for a long time. So, as thanks, I'll give you a handsome reward. I'll make your last living moments. What? Absolutely beautiful. So he's Kylo Ren? Rating. Metaton X makes this his premiere. Okay, let's uh, eat the... Instant noodle. You remove the instant noodles from the packaging. You put some water in the pot and place it on the heat. You wait for the water to boil. <laughs> it's it's boiling. You place the noodles into the pot. Four minutes left. <laughs> Until the noodles are finished. Three minutes left. Until the noodles are finished. Two minutes left. Until the noodles are finished. One minute left. Until the noodles are finished. The noodles are finished, but they're too hot. They don't taste very good. You add flavor packet. That's better. Not great, but better. You ate the instant noodles. You recovered eight. Oh, great. That's, that's, that was so worth it. But how are you on the dance floor? Not very good. Another time. Did he just lose his arms? Uh, arms? Who needs arms with legs like these? I'm still going to win. Shit, shit. No, 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 no. We don't want to eat the snowman piece. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, no. We eat the snowman piece. Shit. No. That's not what I wanted to- Okay, can we restart? Shit! 
I have betrayed you, Snowman Piece. Okay, we have to live with our mistakes. We have to live with our mistakes. Haha. <laughs> so I was wrong. Darling, you really are strong enough to get past Ascor. Well then, it's time for you to go. Don't worry about me. I might seem like I'm dying now, but Dr. Alfie, Alphys can always repair me. And besides, even if I'm not cut out to be a star, I still got to perform for a human, didn't I? So thank you, darling. You've been a great audience. Rip Metaton. I'm really upset I ate the Snowman piece. Alright, so 9S is in here somewhere. We have to find him. And a guy from Kingdom Hearts is in here somewhere too. So you finally made it. The end of your journey is at hand. In a few moments, you will meet the king. Together, you will determine the future of this world. That's then. Now, you will be judged. <clears throat> you will be judged for your every action. You will be judged for every XP you've earned. What's XP? It's an acronym. It stands for Execution Points. A way of quantifying the pain you have inflicted on others. When you kill someone, your XP increases. When you have enough XP, your love increases. Love, too, is an acronym. It stands for Level of Violence. Now you understand. It's time to begin your judgment. Look inside yourself. Have you really done the right thing? And considering what you've done, what will you do now? Take a moment to think about this. Truthfully, it doesn't really matter what you said. All that's important is that you were honest with yourself. What happens now, we leave up to you. Dum -de -dum. Oh, is someone there? Just a moment. I have almost finished watering these flowers. You have horns. Oh, was the, the woman at the beginning the, the queen? Howdy, how can I... Oh, I so badly want to say would you like a cup of tea, but you know how it is. You know what we must do. When you are ready, come into the next room. Ready? Strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. It seems your journey is finally over. You're filled with determination. Human. It was nice to meet you. Goodbye. Oh shit, he destroyed the, the mercy button? Oh wow, he's tough. Nope, not good. Okay, that's the one I die I could I could hit the most on. Okay, so his his eyes flash with the color of what they're gonna be, and you have to not move or move depending on what they are. I think that I think that's what's happening there. Shit. Oh, what the fuck? Okay, one more time. If we take damage, we're gonna heal. Oh, did we do it without healing? Okay. Uh. So that is how it is. Truthfully, I do not want power. I do not want to hurt anyone. I just wanted everyone to have hope, but I cannot take this any longer. I just want to see my wife. I just want to see my child. Please, young one, take my soul and leave this cursed place. Uh, 
after everything I have done to hurt you. You would rather stay down here and suffer than live happily on the surface. Human, I promise you, for as long as you remain here, my wife and I will take care of you as best we can. We could be like, like a family. Flowey, you idiot. You haven't learned a thing. In this world, it's kill or be killed. What? Did it crash? Or is that intentional? Long ago, two races ruled over the earth, humans and monsters. What? Flowey level 99. What the fuck? File erased. Hey, Flowey. Howdy. It's me, Flowey. Flowey the flower. I owe you a huge thanks. You really did a number on that old fool. Without you, I never could have gotten past him. But now, with your help, he's dead. And I've got the human souls. I only have six souls. I still need one more before I become God. And then, with my newfound powers, monsters, humans, everyone, I'll show them all the real meaning of this world. Oh, and forget about escaping to your old save file, it's gone forever. I'll save over your own death, so you can watch me tear you to bloody pieces. Over and over and over. What? Do you really think you can stop me? Hee hee hee. You really are an idiot. What the fuck is this game? What? Do I What? Am, am I dying when it teleports me back there? What the fuck is happening there? What the f that did so much damage. I lost so much health there. Holy crap with the fingers now. They just stare at the red lines. Bugs going to the Venus flytrap. <laughs> Look at the face on a TV screen. What the fuck is that? 
No, no. This can't be happening. You, you. You idiot. called for help. But nobody came. Boy, what a shame. Nobody else is going to get to see you die. What? How do you... Well, I'll just... Load failed. Do you just look down at the load failed? Where are my powers? The souls. What are they doing? No, no. You can't do that. You're supposed to obey me. Stop, stop it. Stop. Mercy. We did mercy so far, mercy. What are you doing? Do you really think I've learned anything from this? No. Sparing me won't change anything. Killing me is the only way to end this. Why? Why are you being so nice to me? I can't understand. I can't understand. I just can't understand. Flowey ran away. Undertale. Well, all right then. Ring, ring. Hey, uh, is anyone there? Well, I'll just leave a message. So, it's been a while since you left. Things have gotten really strange. Everyone clamored to elect a new ruler as fast as possible. So, uh, by process of elimination, Papyrus became the ruler? Why doesn't he talk to you about this? Hello, human? It's strange. Asgore, Alphys, Metaton, and Undine went away. Sand says they went on vacation. I hope they're having fun. Oh yeah, I'm the ruler of the underground now. Everything is improving a lot here. Productivity is up because I tell everyone to keep working and no one goes hungry because I cook everyone's spaghetti. Is Sans gone? You know. Don't tell my brother, but despite the improvements we've made, sometimes this job is kind of hard. Since the king went away, lots of people want to give up. Sometimes even my best encouragement doesn't work. And, and, I miss Undyne too. She never answers my phone calls. She must be having a lot of fun on vacation. I just wish she'd send a postcard. But hey, I won't give up. I can't give up. I have to make everyone give up on giving up. Give up giving up. We'll get out of here slowly. Then we can all hang out again. <laughs> hey, since you defeated me, I've been thinking. Is killing things really necessary? I honestly don't know anymore. I have a request for you. Prove to me. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Get here from the beginning without killing a single thing, and I won't kill the king. Then you'll have your so-called happy ending. How can you not kill the bosses? Okay, um, I kind of want to do this again tomorrow. I kind of, I kind of want to try and do the, um, and do, and do the, the don't kill anyone run tomorrow. But I also would like to do another, another playthrough where I make all the wrong choices and, and, and I, and I, and I, and I attack a lot instead of using the puzzle-like approach that, that we had with, with the act, with the act system. This game was really, really good. This game was really, really good. I really enjoyed this game. It, it, it was funny. It made me smile. It made me laugh. Um, it was interesting. I found the gameplay to be a lot better than I was expecting. I thought it was going to be really shitty turn-based stuff. You know, dude, I myself dabbled in pacifism at one point. Not in Nam, of course. You know what I really liked about the, the music in the game was the mix of uh, of, of the old-style 8-bit um, eight, eight midi-licious kind of stuff with, with actual proper music. It was so good. 
Holy shit, the game was so good. Seriously, the game was so fucking good. We're gonna try pacifist run. So we're not, our, the goal is to not kill anybody. Hey, remember, don't kill anyone. Oh wow, so it's continuing on from the last one. Holy shit. Hold on, three out of four gray rocks recommend that you push them. Later on, there's a room with, with, with three gray rocks in it and there's one that's alive that doesn't want you to push them. So that's that's three and, that's, and this makes four. So that's three out of four. God damn it, game. I was, yeah, I was thinking about the game yesterday, uh, since yesterday. I think maybe you're supposed to get annoyed at, 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 at these battles. And that's, that's kind of the point, is that, is that you're meant to get annoyed, and you're meant to get to this point where you're just like, you know what, fuck it, I'm killing them. I, I, I think, I think that's, I think that's what's supposed to happen. Spider Bakes Hill, all proceeds go to real spiders. I don't know why, but, but, but the, the why, the, the way that they clarified that they're real spiders just really speaks to me. <laughs> You know, it's it's really it's really funny. And I don't think we're gonna put the Temi through through college this time. Right now, someone in chat is probably like, "What the fuck you mean we're not spending? We're taking fucking Temi through college? What the fuck?" So something that I want to say about this game that uh, that you know I'm, I'm sure the guy who made it has gotten this enough. I think that um, Toby Fox's name, right? To, 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 people were saying that um, it was it was heavily inspired by Earthbound, which should be clear. Toby Fox made a game that is better than its inspiration and that is um that's quite a fucking achievement as far as i'm concerned to, su to surpass your inspiration so well fucking done i guess that's 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 just i just wanted to say that tutorial blocks the way okay act talk you thought about telling tutorial that you saw her die but that's creepy can you show mercy without fighting or running away do i weaken her Okay, so at the end you start doing way more damage. So maybe that's when you you try to you show mercy. Maybe one more hit. Fuck. Okay, so how many hits was that? So that was more than I was expecting. Can you show mercy without fighting or running away? So without fighting. Okay, I'm just gonna let her kill me. Oh, there's a magic effect. What are you doing? Attack or run away. What are you proving this way? Okay, this is it. It has to be it. Why are you making this so difficult? Please go upstairs. Haha. -ha. Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. Aw, we get a hug. <laughs> I love sand so much. <laughs> okay, can I run away? Because I don't want to risk fighting you. Maybe I have to... Okay, we'll, 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 we'll be careful. We'll be careful. We'll be careful. Oh my... God, that was not careful. That was not careful. Okay, we're not doing that again. How am I doing? And by I, I mean the piece you, of me I gave to you. Yep. Yeah, it, um, I, I just forgot to bring it back last time. Nothing bad happened to it. I definitely didn't eat it by accident while fighting a robot. That, that definitely didn't happen. Um, what happened is I just forgot to bring it back to you last time. This time we'll remember. This is my favorite one. Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti, it fills you with determination. That, that that's that's my favorite one. <laughs> the microwave next to it. <laughs> oh, sh I, this is the. I don't know why I find that so funny, but it really is. That's that's my favorite one. Warning: dog marriage. <laughs> Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How was that? Understand? Understand the explanation? Yes. Great, then there's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. Not even I will know the solution. <laughs> get ready. Oh shit, we actually have to do it this time?
Also, we didn't stay in the inn last time. Here's your room key. Make sure you bundle up. Oh god. This is hell. This is what hell feels like. Hiya, you look like you had a great sleep. Which is incredible because you were only up there for about two minutes. Here's your money back. You can pay me if you're going to stay overnight. <laughs> tell you about some complex feelings. Somehow, I feel like you're an old friend, even though I've never actually met you before. I can't explain why I feel this way. Did I meet you online? <laughs> I have many social media connections. It's hard to keep track of, of them all. The king of all monsters. He is, well, he's a big fuzzy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. I am certain if you just say, excuse me, Mr. Dreamer, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. Yeah, he, he destroys the mercy button, okay? I don't think so. Okay, let's talk to Flower first. All that gives my life validation is explaining the Echo Flower. No one can know. <laughs> Never trust a flower, that's one of the constants of this world. Is the ketchup thing gonna happen again? Here comes the grub. Want some ketchup? Uh, no. More for me. What the f- <laughs> What? <laughs> oh man, that was so gross. No, holy shit, skeleton man. What the fuck? Okay, so we're wearing, we're wearing, um, what are we wearing? We're wearing the manly bandana and we find a tutu and we're gonna keep the 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 the, the manly bandana on until we until until after we get Papyrus's call and then we'll switch to the tutu. She thought she saw you wearing a bandana. Is that true? Are you wearing a bandana? What will you say? Yes. So you are wearing a bandana. Got it. Wink wink. Have a nice day. Hello, this is Papyrus. Remember when I asked you about clothes? Well, the friend who wanted to know, her opinion of you is very murdery. Well, worry not, dear human. Papyrus would never betray you. I am not a cruel person. I strive to be comforting and pleasant. Papyrus, he smells like the moon. So because of my inherent goodness, I told her you were not wearing a bandana, even though you told me you were. Instead, I made something up. I told her you were wearing a dusty tutu. It pained me to tell such a bold-faced lie. I know you would never ever wear a dusty tutu, but your safety is more important than fashion. Dang. I just want you to be friends with everyone. You f f fuck you game. You just played me like a goddamn fiddle game. You just played me like a goddamn fucking fiddle. Seriously game. Well done. You hum a jazz ballad, Shimer follows your melody. You hum some more, monsters are drawn to the music. Suddenly, it's a concert. Si fa si fa so fa so mi ri ri. Yeah. Sans is selling tickets made of toilet paper. You hum some more, their seats are sold out. You feel like a rock star. You hum some more, but the constant tension. Tours. The groupies, it's all <laughs> aggressive. <laughs> Shyron thinks about her future. You and Shyron have come so far, but it's time. You both have your own journeys to embark on. You hum a farewell song. Final two. You won, you earned 30 gold. That was great. It's a legendary artifact. Will you take it? Take it. You're carrying too many dogs. What? What do you mean I'm carrying too many dogs? I'm not carrying too many dogs. Annoying dog? You deployed the dog. What? What? Where did the annoying dog come from? What the? What? 
Dog residue. Dog item. Jigsaw puzzle left by and finished by dog. Use the artifact is gone. What if I went out and used the dog? What happens if I use the dog residue? You use the dog residue. The rest of your inventory filled up with dog residue. Dog salad. Dog salad heals question question mark HP. Hit poodles. Dog item glowing crystals secre secreted by a dog. Okay, what happens if I use this dog residue? You use dog residue. You finish using it. An uneasy atmosphere fills the room. Okay, what about the other dog? What the fuck with the dog residue? Seems like a regular training dummy. Do you want to beat it up? No. You stare into each other's eyes for a moment. We didn't beat you up. Haha, -ha, too intimidated to fight me. <laughs> Here we go again. Hoi! Welcome to Tem Village. Hoi! I'm Temmy, and this is my friend Temmy. Hoi! I'm Temmy, and this is my friend Temmy. Yeah, I'm not doing this for all of them. Temmies, I hate everything about you. You. You're standing in the way of everybody's hopes and dreams. Alphys' history books made me think humans were cool with their giant robots and flowery swords, man. But you, you're just a coward. And let's not forget your wimpy goody two-shoes shtick. Ooh, I'm making such a difference by hugging random strangers. You know what would be more valuable to everyone? If you were dead. Fuck. <laughs> Every time. Yeah, now we can flee now that we're not very scary. That's it. How would running away solve anything? So it looked like it was it was some unique thing that was happening after I ran away. So she, you're supposed to run her back through the through the caverns, or are you supposed to run forward, little brat. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Shit! <laughs> that was so bad! Oh no! Uh, flee! Run away! Okay, let's so run into run into the cave. Okay. So she's chasing us now. Okay. So that's what we're supposed to do. Oh, the water cooler. Armor so hot, but I can't give up. It's a water cooler. Take a cup of water. Yes. Okay, let's go drink it right in front of her. Give Undyne a cup of water. Yes. Oh, the human arrives. Are you ready to hang out with Undyne? I have a plan to make you two great friends. Will you hang out? Yeah, sure. Okay, stand behind me. Psst, make sure you give her this. She loves these. Hi, Papyrus. Ready for your extra private one-on-one -on -one training? You bet I am. And I brought a <laughs> Hi, I don't think we've... Why don't you two come in? Here, Undyne, my friend, brought a gift for you on their own. Uh, thanks. I'll, uh, put it with the others. <laughs> so, are we ready to start? Whoopsie doopsie, I just remembered. I have to go to the bathroom. You two have fun. <laughs> I guess he really has to go. Then why are you here? Wait, I get it. You think that I'm gonna be friends with you, huh? Right? Never with you, yes. Really? How delightful, I accept. Let's all frolic in the fields of friendship. Not. Why would I ever be friends with you? If you weren't my house guest, I'd beat you up right now. You're the enemy of everyone's hopes and dreams. I will never be your friend. Now get out of my house. Dang, what a shame. I thought Undyne could be friends with you, but I guess I overestimated her. She's just not up to the challenge. Challenge? What? Papyrus, wait a second. Darn it. 
He thinks I can't be friends with you? Fu ha ha, what a joke. I could make friends with a wimpy loser like you any day, and I'll, I'll show him. Listen up, human. We're not just going to be friends. We're going to be besties. Why don't you have a seat? Is Undyne someone's waifu? One time, Alphys's uh, friend came over here. All he did was lie seductively on the piano and fed himself grapes. I don't really like that guy, but I admire his lifestyle. <laughs> you want to see my room? Too bad. No nerds allowed. Well, maybe some nerds. Ooh. Comfortable? I'll get you something to drink. All set. What would you like? Hey, don't get up. You're the guest. Sit down and enjoy yourself. Um, why not just point to what you want? You can use the spear. Oh god. Oh no, sugar. We throw it at her. Undyne slept with Zed. I kind of want to throw it at her, but what if she dies? T-Box blatantly correct. <laughs> Asgore kept getting marshmallows stuck in his beard. Are you hitting on me? Yes. Yeah, Undyne is someone's waifu. I'm sure of it. Believe me, I would gladly give you your fellow swords if you weren't my beloved house guest. The fridge? You want to have the entire fridge? No. Tea, huh? Coming right up. Wow, oh, good thing we had some choice here. Wait a second. Papyrus, his cooking lesson. He was supposed to have that right now. And if he's not here to have it, you'll have to have it for him. Oh no. That's right. Nothing has brought Papyrus and I closer than cooking, which means that if I give you his lesson, we'll become closer than you can ever imagine. Fuhuhu, afraid we're gonna be best friends. <laughs> Let's start with the sauce. Envision these vegetables as your greatest enemy. Now, pound them to dust with your fists. How will you pound? Strong, strong. You punch the vegetables to full force. You knock over a tomato. Yeah, yeah. Our hearts are uniting against these healthy ingredients. Now, it's my turn. Nigga. I just killed a tomato. We just ruined the, we just ruined the run. Uh, we'll just scrape this into a bowl later, but for now, are we making spaghetti? We're making spaghetti. But I just buy store brand. They're the cheapest. Nigga. <laughs> just put them in the pot. How do you put them in? Fiercely. Fiercely, you throw everything into the pot as hard as you can, including the box. It clanks against the empty bottom. Yeah, I'm into it. All right, now it's time to stir the pasta. As a general rule of thumb, the more you stir, the better it is. Ready? Let's do it. Stir harder. <laughs> That's the stuff. Alright, now for the final step. Turn up the heat. Let the stovetop symbolize your passion. Let your hopes and dreams turn into burning fire. Ready? Don't hold anything back. Hold right to turn up the heat. Hotter. This is not gonna go well. This is not gonna go well. Wait, that's... You got ending F for fire. Ah, man. No wonder Papyrus sucks at cooking. I can't force you to like me, human. Some people just don't get along with each other. I understand if you feel that way about me. And if we can't be friends, that's okay. Because if we're not friends, it means I can destroy you without regret. I've been defeated. My house is in shambles. I even failed to befriend you. That's it. I don't care if you're my guest anymore. One final rematch. All out on both sides. It's the only way I can regain my lost pride. Now come on, hit me with all you got. Undyne is letting you make the first- No, we're not attacking. Show me what you got. No! Act. Fake attack. You pretend to swing it and die with all your might.
What? That's the best you can manage? Even attacking at full force? You just can't muster any intent to hurt me, huh? Huh. You know what? I don't actually want to hurt you either. At first, I hated your stupid... I can never say this word. Saccharin? I think it's saccharin, right? Saccharin shtick, but... The way you hit me right now, it reminded me of someone I used to train with. Now I know you aren't just some wimpy loser. You're a wimpy loser with a big heart. Well, that was fun, huh? We'll have to hang out again another time. But, uh, somewhere else, I guess. In the meantime, I guess I'll go hang out, hang with Papyrus. So, if you need me, drop by Snowden, okay? Sounds like only fire lives here now. <laughs> ring, ring, banana phone. That's Undyne's house. It's a great place to, uh, huff, puff. Yeah, that's my house. Hi, Undyne. How'd you get here so fast? I ran. Wowee. Undyne, someday I want to be as strong and sweaty as you. <laughs> All right, that that was uh, that was um, uh, that was interesting. What monster is this? Metatide. I'm so flattered you remembered. <laughs> a substitution? You mean use a different non-human ingredient? Why? Um, what if someone's Vegan? <laughs> Vegan? <laughs> uh, actually, I have not have an option right here. The timing for so many jokes in this game is, is just excellent. Hey, buddy, want to buy a hot dog? No. Yep, you gotta save your money for college and spiders. <laughs> Oh, shit. Hi, it's Dr. Elphis. This puzzle is kind of on timing based. You, you, you see the switches over there? You'll have to press all of them within three seconds. I'll try to help you with the rhythm. <laughs> I love that she, in she interrupts and that makes it so you can hit the button. I love that so much. Alphys update status, oh my god, people think Mew Mew 2 is better than Mew Mew 1. Lol, that's a joke, right? I know. So Mew Mew is, is, is the Dark Souls of, um, of, uh, of Undertale's world, I guess? Oh no, how could this happen? Foiled again by the brilliant Dr. Alphys. That's right. <laughs> Was Metaton about to say his line? Like, fronting? Come on, Metaton, give up already. You'll never be able to defeat us. Yeah, let's stay. Fabulous. We'll escort you to your room. Yeah, we didn't do this last time. No, 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 don't go. No, no, we're not done yet. I was enjoying that. No. All right, so with, assuming that I'm right with what they said, I want to change my outfit at some point. I want when everything, when I get low health, I want to pose dramatically. I think we even did the X-ray in it and something happened. We want to eat the burger and we want to heal turn healing. We want to heal turn to him. I don't understand. You have to just get the ratings high? Pose. So pose dramatic. Despite being hurt, you pose dramatically. The audience applauds. Okay, that... On-brand food, 500. Okay, how how uh, how high do I need to get it? Okay, uh, boast? You say you aren't going to get hit at all. Oh, no. Shit. Oh, wow, that was so close. Oh, fuck. Holy shit, that was close there with the, with the disco ball. Okay, we're over 10,000. How high do we go? Oh, look at these ratings. This is the most viewers I've ever had. We've reached the viewer call-in milestone. One lucky viewer will have the chance to talk to me before I leave the underground forever. Let's see who calls in first. Hi, is it Alphys? What do you have to say on this, our last show? Oh. Hi, Metaton. I really liked watching your show. My life is pretty boring, but seeing you on the screen brought excitement to my life vicariously. I can't tell, but I guess this is the last episode. I'll miss you, Metaton. Oh, I didn't mean to talk so long. Oh, no, wait, wait. They, they already hung up. I'll take another caller. 
Metaton, your show made us so happy. Metaton, I don't know what I'll watch without you. Metaton, there's a Metaton shaped hole in my Metaton shaped heart. Uh, I, I see. Everyone, thank you so much. Darling, perhaps it might be better if I stay here for a while. Humans already have stars and idols, but monsters, they only have me. So I think I'll have to delay my big debut. Besides, you've proven to be very strong. Perhaps even strong enough to get past Asgore. I'm sure you'll be able to protect humanity. Haha. <laughs> it's all for the best anyway. The truth is, this form's energy consumption is inefficient. In a few moments, I'll run out of battery power and, well, I'll be alright. Knock him dead, darling. And everyone, thank you. You've been a great audience. All right, so we did it. Was that was that the way that we do it without um without killing him? I think we did it. Oh look, he has a unique kind of thing there. That's neat. I I managed to open the lock. Are you two? Oh my God, Kylo Ren, Metaton, Metaton, are you? Thank God, it's just the batteries. Metaton, if you were gone, I would have, I would have. So you finally made it. The end of your journey is at hand. Now you will be judged. But you, you never gained any love. Of course, that doesn't mean you're completely innocent or naive, just that you kept a certain tenderness in your heart. No matter the struggles or hardships you, f you faced, you strive to do the right thing. You refuse to hurt anyone. Even when you ran away, you did it with a smile. You never gained love, but you gained, but you gained love. Does that make sense? Maybe not. Now, you're about to face the greatest challenge of your entire journey. Your actions here will determine the fate of the entire world. If you refuse to fight, Asgore will take your soul and destroy humanity. But if you kill Asgore and go home, the monsters will remain trapped underground. What will you do? Alright, we're all counting on you, kid. Good luck. Ring. Hey, uh, this is Undyne. Shut up, Papyrus. This was your idea. Human, you have to deliver something for me. Uh, please? I'm at Snowden in front of Papyrus's. See ya, punk. That's Alphys' house. Hey, why don't we all go over and watch anime? Anime? Isn't that a kind of cartoon for small children? Oh, shit. Anime isn't just for kids. It's deep. It's emotional. It's the sound of a, ba a baby makes an emotion. Yeah, because it's how I'm feeling right now. Oh, shit. Fucking wow. It's a door. You use a mysterious key, the door's lock clicks as you fail to fit the key into it. You fucking asshole game. You fucking asshole game. Really? 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 There's 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 a unique fucking God damn it game. Um so I have a favor to ask you. Uh I need you to deliver this letter. To Dr. Alphys, uh-huh. Why don't I do it myself? Um, well, well, it's kind of personal, but we're friends, so I'll to tell you. Hotland sucks. I don't want to have to go over there. So here you go. You slide the letter under the door and give it a knock. Oh, oh no, no. Is that another letter? I don't want to open it. Good, can't. I just slide it back out. No, no, I can't keep doing this. I'll read this one. Hey, if this is a joke, it's... Oh my god, did you write this letter? It wasn't signed, so I had no idea who could have... Oh my god, oh no. That's adorable. And I ha had no idea you um, wrote that way. It's surprising, too. After all the gross stuff I did, I don't really deserve to be forgiven. Much less, um, this? And so passionately, too. What the fuck was in the letter? You know what? Okay, I'll do it. It's the least I can do to make it up to you. Yeah, yeah, let's go on a date. Oh, no. Not another date. Dating start. Oh, no. How, how do I look? My friend helped me pick out this dress. She's got a great sense of, um, anyway, let's do this thing. Date. No, let's, no, we didn't, we didn't.
Hey, 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 wait, wait, wait. Actually, we still can't start the date yet. Dating stop. Um, I've got to give you items to raise your affection statistic first. That'll increase the chances of successful outcome to the date, right? What kind of games do you play, Elphys? Dating, start. Yeah, let's, uh, date. What are you doing, Undertale? Uh, do you like anime? Shit, I want to hit no. No, fuck. Like anime? The contract has been sealed. Fuck, it, may, it tricked me into hitting yes, thinking it, there was another prompt. You, I don't like anime. No, no, Discord's gonna go fucking mental. Oh, fuck. There's gonna be a clip of this, and they're gonna post it every time we talk about anime. Look, the game asked you that, oh, do you like anime? And hey, you hit yes, so that proves it. Oh, you didn't lie through Undertale, did you? Fuck. Oh, no, no. No, I don't like anime. I don't like anime. I don't like anime. No. Do I? No. Here we are. This is where Undyne and I come all the time. We find all sorts of great stuff here. Oh no. That's her over there. I can't can't let her see me on a date with you. Why? Because, uh, well, oh no. Here she comes. Hey, there you are. I, uh, realized if you delivered that thing, it might be a bad idea, so I'm gonna I'm gonna do it. Give it to me, huh? You don't have it? Naga. Have you at least seen her? Yeah. Yes. So she's somewhere around here. Thanks. I'll keep looking. Oh my God. Well, well. I guess it's obvious, huh? I uh, I really like her. I mean, more than I like other people. I'm sorry. I just, just figured, you know, it'd be for fun to go on like a cute kind of pretend date with you to make you feel better. Oh, fuck you, Alphys. Well, you know what? I don't like anime, but how can I tell Undyne the tr truth? I do don't have the confidence. I'm going to mess it up. How can I practice? Let's role play it. Obviously, let's role play. Oh, this is... A... Is this punishment for saying I like anime? That actually kind of sounded fun. It's not going to be. Okay, which one of us will be undying? Um, I'll be undying. Oh, right, obviously. He he he. Ahem. Hi, undying. How are you doing today? I'm fine. You're yo or cute. You're cute. Th thanks. You say that a lot, and I never know what to say. But I know you just mean it platonically because we're just friends. He 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 he. Uh, so I'd like to um talk to you about something. What is it, Alphys? Then, sh then she kisses. Yep. That what? Undyne would never. Uh, I kiss her back softly. Oh shit! This is getting a little fucking PG-13 and fucking ending R for rated R. Holy shit! Automata's got nothing on this. I I look gently into her eyes. I don't. I'm. A, I don't like where this is going. I start hollering. Oh, this is getting worse. Undyne, I love you. Undyne, kiss me again, Undyne. What did you just say? Wait a second. Are you two on a date? No. I guess, I mean, uh, no. I mean, we were, but I mean, actually, we were only romantically role playing as you. What? I mean, I mean, Undyne, I, I've been lying to you. What? About what? About, well, everything. I told you that seriously like, I really just want to use to make ice cream and those human history books I keep reading those are just dorky comic books and the history movies those those are just uh, anime they aren't real I, and that time I told you I was busy with work on the phone I was just eating frozen yogurt in my pajamas that's <laughs> help this I I just wanted to impress you I just wanted you to think I was smart and cool that I wasn't some nerdy loser Alphys Undyne, I really think you're neat, okay? Alphys. Shh. Shh. Break her neck. Yep. It's already over. Alphys, I think you're neat too, I guess. But you've got to realize most of what you said really doesn't matter to me. I don't care if you're watching kid cartoons or reading history books. To me, all of that stuff is just nerdy crap. What I like about you is that you're passionate, you're analytical, 
It doesn't matter what what it is, you care about it 100% at maximum power, so you don't have to lie to me. Alphys, I want to help you become happy with who you are, and I know just the training you need to do that. Cooking training? Are we gonna make spaghetti? Undyne. <laughs> She's, she's gone full Oscar the Grouch. <laughs> Undyne, you, you're gonna train me? What? Me? Oh, no. I don't like where this is going. Jogloy? What the fuck is on his shirt? Jog, jog, jogloy? Loy? What? Get those bones shaken. It's time to jog 100 laps. Hooting about how great we are. Ready? I'm about to start the timer. Uh, Undyne, I'll do my best. In the garbage can? Oh my god. She was kidding, right? Those cartoons, those comics, those are still real, right? Anime is real, right? I wish it wasn't. Anime is real. Anime is not real. Anim anime is real. Yeah, ha ha ha. I knew it. Gigantic swords, magical princesses, here I come. Uh, thanks for taking care of Alphys. I didn't get to say what I wanted to, but things seem like they're going to get better for her. Well, I gotta catch up with them later. Ring. Howdy. If it isn't my good friend who trusts me, this is Papyrus, your also mutual friend. Alphys and I finished our training early, very early, so I sent her home, very home. Uh, now I feel strongly and for no apparent reason. You should also go there to her lab house. I have only good feelings about this. Goodbye. If the game makes me watch anime, I'm turning it off. I want to be clear. This isn't anyone else's problem but mine. But if you don't ever hear from me again, if you want to know the truth, enter the door to the north of this note. Entry number one. This is it. Time to do what the king ha has asked me to do. I will create the power to free us all. I will unleash the power of the soul. Is it like a synthetic human soul for real? Entry number two, the barrier is locked by soul power. Unfortunately, this power cannot be recreated artificially. Soul power can only be derived from what was once living. So to create more, we will have to use what we have now, the souls of monsters. Oh shit, Alphys, what did you do? Is it, f what? Oh, it's Gygus, okay. Why, why is Gygus here? I don't want to fight Gygus. Alphys, did you make Flowey? Okay, what happens if I go into bed? Okay. Spooky Spoon, okay. Spooky Spoon is getting excited, okay. Uh, Spooky Spoon is gonna touch me. No. Oh, Spooky Spoon tucked me in. Okay, thank you, Spooky Spoon. Another save point. Oh, shit. You're not a save point at all. You're a mimic. Smells like sweet lemons. Lemon bread. Um. Flex? You flex your arm, lemon bread muscle shakes. Welcome to my special hell. Look at the red parts around the teeth. What the fuck is that all about? In room 7, we'll need a vessel to wield the monster souls when the time comes. After all, a monster cannot absorb the souls of other monsters, just as a human cannot absorb a human soul. So then, what about something that's neither human nor monster? A flower. What? It's... it's... what? Something afraid? What? Pick on, but it was already picked on. Okay. You're not afraid enough? Oh, what the fuck, game? Never have butterflies been so terrifying. There's a VHS player with a few tapes picked out beside it. They seem to be labeled in a specific order. Will you watch one? Okay, Waffles, are you ready? Do your creepy- What? Waffles? How am I in these? Do your creepy- Ah, uh, I can't- I can't be the kid that- that fell and died and they took me back to the flowers and then I- I came- Wouldn't I remember? 
And wouldn't the king recognize me? It seems like this controls the elevator's power. Turn it on? Yes. It seems like. Maybe it doesn't. Okay. Hey, stop. I got you guys some food, okay? Sorry about that. They get kind of sassy when they don't get fed on time. I suppose I owe you an explanation. As you probably know, Asgore asked me to study the nature of souls. During my research, I isolated a power I called Dark Souls. I injected it into dying monsters so their souls would last after death. But the experiment failed. So this, this, this is just a, a prequel to, to, to Dark Souls. Okay, because they linger and you can make people stronger. Okay, but the experiment failed. You see, unlike humans, monsters, bodies... Um, don't have enough physical matter to take those connect concentrations of determination. Their bodies started to melt and lost what phys physicality they had. Pretty soon, all the test subjects had melted together into those. Seeing them like this, I knew I couldn't tell their families about it. So, so wait, so you just, you just held them here and fed them and then went upstairs and went on social networks and just bitched about fucking anime? What if those families follow you on, on, on monster Twitter? Oh, he's not telling me where my loved one is after telling me it, he miraculously came back to life. But here he is bitching about kissy, kissy, kitty, shitty show, too. What? Human. It was nice to meet you. Goodbye. What? What a miserable creature, torturing such a poor, innocent youth. It is not right to sacrifice someone simply to let someone leave here. Is that not what I've been trying to prevent this whole time? So, for now, let us suspend this battle. As terrible as Asgard is, he deserves mercy too. Tori, you came back. Do not Tori me, dreamer. You pathetic whelp. What? If you really wanted to free our kind, you could have gone through the barrier after you got one soul taken six souls from the humans, then come back and freed everyone peacefully. What? But instead, you made everyone live in despair because you would rather wait here meekly hoping another human never comes. Naga, Asgore, human, nobody fight each other. Everyone's gonna make friends or else I'll... I'll... Hello, I am Toriel. Are you the human's friend? It is nice to meet you. Uh, yeah? Nice to meet you. Hey, Asgore, is that your ex? Jeez, that's rough, buddy. <laughs> hey, nobody hurt each other. Hey, nobody fight anyone. If anyone fights anyone, then I'll be forced to ask Undyne for help. Hello? Oh, hello, your majesty. Psst, hey, human. Did Asgore shave? And clone himself? <laughs> hey, guys, what's up? That voice... Hello, I think we may know each other. Oh, hey, I recognize your voice, too. I am Toriel. So nice to meet you. The name's Sans. And, uh, same. Oh, wait, then. This must be your brother, Papyrus. Greetings, Papyrus. It is so nice to finally meet you. Your brother has told me so much about you. Wowee. I can't believe Asgore's clone knows who I am. This is the best day of my life. Hey, Papyrus. What does a skeleton tile his roof with? Hmm, snowproof roof tiles? No, silly. A skeleton tells his roof with shingles. I changed my mind. This is the worst day of my life. Come on, Asgore. It's gonna be okay. There are plenty of fish in the sea. Yeah, Asgore. Undyne's totally right about that fish thing. So sometimes you just got to, uh, to stop going after furry boss monsters and, uh, to just get to know a really cute fish. It's a metaphor. I don't think it is in your case. Oh my god. Will you two just smooch already? Metaton is my waifu, I think. No, he's right. Let's do it. Well, uh, I guess if you want to, then don't hold anything back. Oh god. Well, wait. Thank you. Thank you, Tori. Thank you. Wait. Not in front of the human. Uh, right. So sorry. I got a little carried away there. He he he. My child, it seems as if you must stay here for a while, but looking at all the great friends you have made, I think, I think you'll be happy here. I don't think I'm going to be happy here. You're all insane. Hey, that reminds me. 
Genocide's looking pretty good right now. You called everyone here, right? Well, besides, uh, her, uh, anyway, if I got here before you, how did you know how to call everybody? Let's just say, a tiny flower helped me. A tiny flower? You idiots. While you guys were having your little powwow, I took the human souls. And now, not only are those under my power, but all of your friend's souls are gonna be mine too. Hee hee hee. And you know what the best part is? It's all your fault. It's all because you made them love you. All the time you spent listening to them, encouraging them, caring about them. Without that, they wouldn't have come here. And now, with their souls and the humans together, I will achieve my real form. Hee <laughs> hee. Huh? Why am I still doing this? Don't you get it? This is all just a game. If you leave the underground satisfied, you'll win the game. If you win, you'll, you won't want to play with me anymore. And what would I do then? But this game between us will never end. I'll hold victory in front of you just within your reach, and then tear it away just before you grasp it, over and over and over. Hee hee hee. What? Do not be afraid, my child. No matter what happens, we will always be there to protect you. That's right, human. You can win. Just do what I would do. Believe in you. Hey, human. You got past me. You can do anything, so don't worry. We're with you all the way. Huh? You haven't beaten this guy yet? Come on. This weirdo's got nothing on you. Technically, it's impossible for you to beat him, but, but somehow, I know you can do it. Human, for the future of humans and monsters, you have to stay determined. La la la, we're with you too. Come on, you got this. You've got to win. You can do it. Rip it. <laughs> Rip it. Erg. No. Unbelievable. This can't be happening. You. You. You idiot. I can't believe you're all so stupid. All of your souls are mine. Flowey's going full Kafka. Finally, I was so tired of being a flower. Azriel, dreamer. Yep, okay, that makes sense, it does, okay. It's the end. Hope, you held on to your hopes. You reduced how much damage you'll take this turn. It's the end, dream. You think about why you're here now. You can feel the empty space in your inventory get smaller and smaller. The true final battle is finally beginning. What? Dream. Grimes fill up your dreams. Holy shit, the music. You know, I don't care about destroying this world anymore. What the fuck? What the fuck? I tried to defeat you and gain total control over the timeline. I just want to reset everything. All your progress, everyone's memories. I'll bring them all back to zero. Okay, that's really hard, but it refused. This is the end. Then we can do everything all over again. Okay. That was not too bad. You know what the best part of all this is? You'll do it.
used to me again. Shit. Because you want to have your friend. Because you love your friends. Because you never give up. Isn't that delicious? Your determination and the power that let you get this far, it's going to be your downfall. Now, enough messing around. It's time to purge this time and once and for all. After that attack, you're still standing in my way? Wow, you really are something special, but don't get cocky. Up until now, I've only been using a fraction of my real power. Let's see what good your determination is against this. Astral blocks the way. Behold my true power. Still, you're hanging on? That's fine. In a few moments, you'll forget everything, too. That attitude will serve you well in your next life. I'm not seeing a way out of this, Waffles. The whole world is ending. Can't move your body. Er, uh, haha. Still? Come on. Show me what good your determination is now. Move your body. Nothing happened. You struggle. Nothing happened. You tried to reach for your save file. Nothing happened. You tried again to reach your save file. Nothing happened. Seems saving the game really is impossible. But... Maybe, with what little power you have, you can save something else. Save? Oh, what? You reached out to Azriel's soul and called out to your friends. They're in there somewhere, aren't they? Within the depths of Azriel's soul, something, something's resonating. The lost souls appeared. Lost soul. No, 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 not fighting. No, why are you fighting? Why are you fighting? Why are you fighting? Why are you fighting? Uh, puzzle. You asked the Lost Soul for help with a puzzle. He doesn't know why, but he really wants to help you. Then everyone will. Why even try? Take a break. You asked the Lost Soul to take a break from his fighting with you. It seems like it wants to. We'll never see him again. A joke. You told the Lost Soul a bad pun about skeletons. Suddenly, the memories are flooding back. No, wait, you're my friend. Nah, I'm rooting for you, kid. I could never capture you. A lost soul appeared. Fake hit. Tap the lost soul lightly. Something about the way you fight is familiar to her. All humans will die. Clash. You clashed against the lost soul with all your might. She recognizes your fighting spirit. Suddenly, memories are flooding back. Well, some humans are okay, I guess. Encourage. Nerd out. You ask the lost soul what her favorite cartoon is. She can barely hold back from giving you an enormous answer. You hate me, don't you? Quiz. You ask the lost soul for help on a quiz question, and suddenly, memories are flooding back. No, that's not true. My friends like me, and I like you, too. Preference. You tell the lost soul you prefer butterscotch instead of cinnamon. Somehow, she faintly recalls hearing this before. This is for your own good. Forgive me for this. Mercy? You tell the lost soul that you won't hurt him, no matter what. Something about this is so familiar to him. It's all flooding back. Your fate is up to you now. You are our future. Strangely, as your friends remembered you, are we going to call Azrael back? Something else began resonating within the soul, stronger and stronger. It seems that there's still one last person that needs to be saved. But who? Suddenly, you realize. You reach out and call their name. Huh? What are you doing? Feel your friend's souls resonating within Azriel. Azriel Dreamer. What what did you do? What's this feeling? What's happening to me? No, no, I don't need anyone. I'm doing this because you're special, Waffles. You're the only one that understands me. You're the only one who's any fun to play with anymore. It's not just it. 
I, I'm doing this because I care about you, Waffles. I care about you more than anybody else. I'm not ready for this to end. I'm not ready for you to leave. I'm not ready to say goodbye to someone like you again. So please, stop doing this. And just let me win. Stop it. Stop it now. What the hell? Holy shit. I'm so alone, Waffles. I'm so afraid, Waffles. Waffles, I... I... I'm so sorry. I always was a crybaby, wasn't I, Waffles? I know. You're not actually Waffles, are you? Waffles being gone for a long time. Um, what... What is your name? Frisk? That's... A nice name. As a flower, I was soulless. I lacked the power to love other people. However, with everyone's souls inside me, I not only have my own compassion back, but I can feel every other monster's as well. They all care about each other so much, and they care about you too, Frisk. I wish I could tell you how everyone feels about you. Papyrus Sands, Undyne, Alphys, Toriel, monsters are weird. Even though they barely know you, it feels like they all really love you. I understand if you hate me. I acted so strange and horrible. I hurt you. I hurt so many people. Friends, family, bystanders. There's no excuse for what I've done. Forgive. Well, what? Frisk, come on. You're... you're gonna make me cry again. Besides, even if you do forgive me, I can't keep these souls inside of me. The least I can do is return them. But first, there's something I have to do. Right now, I can feel everyone's hearts beating as one. They're all burning with the same desire, with everyone's power, with everyone's determination. It's time for monsters to finally go free. barrier was destroyed. In a little while, I'll turn back into a flower. I'll stop being myself. I'll stop being able to feel love again. So, Frisk, it's best if you just forget about me, okay? Just go be with the people who love you. Comfort him. Frisk, please help me explain what anime is to Asgore. You see, it's like a cartoon, but for children. With swords. So it's like a cartoon, but with swords? Golly, that sounds neat. It's not. It's not. Don't listen. Don't. All anime fans are like, this has gore. Don't. Like, no. Don't fall for the trap. It's not. Howdy Frisk. Sorry about almost trying to take your soul. I feel very bad about it. I hope we can still be pals. Hey, don't worry about it, Asgore. I think everybody's tried to kill Frisk at least once. Oh, I see. In that case, I'm not sorry, Frisk. Asgore, that's not what I meant. <laughs> oh, now you're doing it even faster, trying to finish up work. <laughs> that's great. He's doing that even faster? Holy shit. Hmm, now that our parents are the same entity, does that mean I'm married to my sister? Wait, we're dogs. That stuff's normal. <laughs> Feel that piece of me is being well taken care of. Hmm. The barriers opened up. Hmm. Then, if it's not too much to ask, could you take that piece of me to the surface? I would really appreciate it. <laughs> Looks like the cheese has a nibble taken out of it. You go, mouse. You go, mouse. Mouse finally got the cheese. I'm so excited. Frisk, you came from this world, right? So you must have a place to return to, do you not? What will you do now? I want to stay with you. I have places to go. Well, let's let's go with the monster side. What? Frisk? 
You really are a funny child. If you had said that earlier, none of this would have happened. It is a good thing you took so long to change your mind. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Did you really think it was over? Just kidding. I mean, we haven't even done a special thanks yet. Ready? Let's end all this for good. Oh no, it's Tom it all over again. It's Tom it all over again. I'm the bad guy. Duh. Today we are doing the genocide run of Undertale. Seems as if everyone is perfectly happy. Monsters have returned to the surface. Peace and prosperity will rule across the land. Take a deep breath. There's nothing left to worry about. You still have the power to reset everything. Toriel, Sans, Asgore, Alphys, Papyrus, Undyne. If you so choose, everyone will be ripped from this timeline. So please, just let them go. Let Frisk be happy. Let Frisk live their life. That was interesting. That was cool. True reset. Oh man, really? Let's go with Waffle. Let's go with Waffle. Let's see, because I want to go with a different name because I want to see if, if they ever say Waffles again, if it really is a true reset. So let's beat the shit out of this dummy. You won. Ah, uh, the dummies are not for fighting. They are for talking. We do not want to hurt anybody, do we? Come now. Oh, we do. We do want to hurt everybody. We're running around waiting for things to spawn so we can level up. Now it's a JRPG. Determination. What? That's new. You want to leave so badly? Humph. You are just like the others. There is only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Oh, sh what the fuck? What? You really hate me that much? Now I see who I was protecting by keeping you here. Not you, but them. Ha. Huh. Holy shit! Holy sh <laughs> Oh fuck, okay. I'm expecting that this this is gonna go differently with Sans. The old whoopee cushion and the hand trick. It's always funny. That's uh your cue to laugh or uh to emote at all. Gee, lady, you really know how to pick them, huh? Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. Da, da, da. Uh, okay, I guess you don't have to. What? Sans, have you found a human yet? Yeah. Really? Wowee. Guess that's settled. That worked out, huh? Are you just gonna stare at me or? All right, this is really cool. This is this is this is really different. Well, I'll be straightforward with you, my brother. My brothered really like to see a human, so you know, it really helped me out if you kept pretending to be one. Oh shh. Prepare yourself for hijinks, for low jinks, dangers, puzzles, capers, japers, being captured, and other sorts of fun activities. Refreshments will be provided if you dare. <laughs> and you don't even bat an eye, huh? Shit, Sans is on to me. Hello, I'm Snowman. I cannot move. Traveler, if you could, you got the Snowman piece. <laughs> you ate the Snowman piece. Oh me, oh my, what are you doing? Soon there won't be any me left. You got the Snowman piece. You ate the Snowman piece. Stop, please. You got the Snowman piece. You ate the Snowman piece. A useless pile of snow. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha.
<laughs> oh no. Escape appears. Jerry came to fucking Jerry. I'm happy we get to kill Jerry. Okay, is the other one gonna go crazy? Kneel and suffer. Yeah, it looks like it. Hey, it's the human. You're gonna love this puzzle. It was made by the great. Are you serious? Sans, help. They keep walking through my puzzles. They're supposed to let me explain them, then threaten and baffle them with dangerous japes. Well, maybe they don't like japes. Everyone likes japes. What about Undyne? Doesn't she hate puzzles? She hates puzzles, but she loves japes. That makes sense. <laughs> this is a little, a little boring, but again, maybe that's the point. W w before it was, it's it's faster just attack them when when you're fighting them. I think, than figure out all the puzzles. So there's this pull to just just fight and just get through them very quickly. And now this this is. This is boring and takes so long because it's it's I think it's it's sp supposed to be showing to you that it's it's a deliberate thing that you're going out of your way to do. It's th there aren't enough random encounters as you're walking through the area to naturally kill everything as you go. You have to do work in order to to, to clear out every area. I just have the wrong audience. Think about how much fun Undyne would have here. Flames, violence, it's right up her alley. So I won't waste this puzzle on you. I just have to appreciate the friend I already have. Ooh. Phew. A valuable life lesson. <laughs> why is... Why is... Was that Flowey? But nobody came. Take? What? Steal? He took 758G from behind the counter. Read. There's a note here. Please don't hurt my family. I love. I love the 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 the, the point that it's making with um, no answer. That you, you're just you're just killing everything without really thinking about it. So that means you 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 don't want puzzles or or NPCs to talk to. <laughs> it's it's the the gamer path. You know what I mean? It's just yeah. Just 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 go. Th yeah, we're just taking all this stuff out. Don't worry about it. You don't have to worry about that. Halt, human. Hey, quit moving while I'm talking to you. I, the Great Papyrus, have some things to say. First, you're a freaking weirdo. Not only do you not like puzzles, but the way you shamble from place to place, the way your hands are always covered in dusty powder, it feels like your life is going down a dangerous path. However, I, Papyrus, see great potential within you. Everyone can be a great person if they try. And me, I hardly have to try at all. <laughs> Hey, quit moving. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Human, I think you are in need of guidance. Someone needs to help to keep you on the straight and narrow. But worry not, I, Papyrus, will gladly be your friend and tutor. I will turn your life right around. I see you are approaching. Are you offering a hug of acceptance? Wowee, my lessons are already working. I, Papyrus, welcome you with open arms. Papyrus is sparing you. Oh shit. Well, well, that's not what I expected. But still, I believe in you. You can do a little better, even if you don't think so. I, I promise. Rip Papyrus. F. Fool, you think you can hurt me? I am a ghost that lives inside a dummy. My cousin used to live inside a dummy too, until you came along. Not only did your actions cause them to leave their home, but now all of their neighbors are gone too. You're the worst person I've ever met. I've never been more mad. Goo! My mannequin levels are going off the charts. Question mark, this, this feeling. Eureka, 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 human. That moment of unbridled emotion, it allowed me to finally fuse with my body. I'm fully corporeal now, my lifelong dream realized. In return, I guess I won't stomp you. How's that sound? <laughs> oh, we're cruel. You'd better stop right where you are, because if you want to hurt anyone else, you're, you're going to have to get through me first. 
and and, and oh sh shit! Really? Undone. You're you're hurt. Hurt. It's nothing. Next time, listen when I tell you to leave. Okay? Undyne, I, I'll take care of this. Get out of here. Game chickened out. You almost killed the kid. Heh. <laughs> it's nothing. No. Somehow, with just one hit, I'm already, already. Damn it. Papyrus, Elphis, Asgore, just like that, I, I failed you. Just one hit. What? No, my body, it feels like it's splitting apart, like any instant I'll scatter into a million pieces, but deep, deep in my soul, there's a burning feeling I can't describe, a burning feeling that won't let me die. This isn't just about monsters anymore, is it? If you get past me, you'll you'll destroy them all, won't you? Monsters, humans, everyone. Everyone's hopes, everyone's dreams, vanquished in an instant. But I won't let you do that. Right now, everyone in the world, I can feel their hearts beating as one. And we all have one goal, to defeat you, human. No, whatever you are, for the sake of the whole world, I, Undyne, will strike you down. What? You're gonna have to try a little harder than that. The heroine appears? Undying the undying? What? Oh, the music. Oh, I love the music in this game. Well, okay then, that's a difficulty spike. Holy shit. Yep. All right, that's tough. <laughs> you cannot give up just yet, Waffle. Stay determined. Asgore, why are you telling me to, to, to keep going? Yep, yep, this is hard. Sorry. Why did that one not work too soon? <laughs> I remember that fucking movie on normal mode too. The 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 yellow ones that come from the other side. Every time, it's like when someone. Someone is when someone shows you the word red, but the letters are green, and they and they and they quickly say to you, "What color is this?" And and you're like, "Uh," and and and, and you you want to say, you want to say um, red because that's what the word says, but the color is green. That's what it feels like to me. What? 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 Why? Why? Why so slow? Why so slow? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> what are you doing, Undyne? What are you doing, Undyne? Okay, we got her. Holy fuck, that was pretty tough. Damn it. So even that power, it wasn't enough. If you, if you think I'm gonna give up hope, you're wrong. 
because I've got my friends behind me. Okay, that was pretty tough. I don't know, know if that fight is legitimately tough or if I'm just bad, but yeah, that, that seemed pretty tough to me. Oh, there you are, you ugly little creature. You've made quite a name for yourself. Such infamy, I'm impressed. Oh, yes, if you're looking for Alphys, she's not here. While you were busy doing your ahem thing, she was running around evacuating people to safety. Now they're in a place where you'll never get to them. Deciding not to fight you. My, my, she really is the only smart one, isn't she? Oh, how sassy. You're just itching to get your hands on me, aren't you? Well, to 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 oo oo bad or T O O B A D. This world needs stars more than it needs corpses. Toodles. Sundary plane. Oh shit, it crashes? Oh no, what the fuck? But we bought spider cider. What? Oh no. Oh no. Threaten. Sorry, little weirdo. Threats won't work on me. I can't go to hell. I'm all out of vacation days. Maybe the last boss will be a Temmie. And he'll show up and go, Hoi! I'm the last boss Temmie. My mouse, my mouse, so you finally arrived. After our first meeting, I realized something ghastly. You're not just a threat to monsters, but humanity as well. Oh my, that's an issue. You see, I can't be a star without an audience. And besides, there are some people I want to protect. Ahaha, eager as always, eh? But don't touch that dial. There's something you haven't accounted for. As any true fan would know, I was first created as a human eradication robot. It was only after becoming a star that I was given a more photogenic body. However, those or original functions have never been fully removed. Come any closer and I'll be forced to show you my true form. Fine then. Ready, it's showtime. Meditan Neo blocks the way. Oh. Get. Guess you don't want to join my fan club? Alright. Rip Meditan. F. Okay, this is the, the locket, right? Yeah, the locket's way better. The locket is... Defense 99? What? You got the real, real knife. Real knife. Weapon attack 99. Here we are. Real knife. Not, not a worn knife like it was last time. Just a straight up real fucking knife. What the fuck? Okay. Let's uh let's put the empty gun in the box too. I don't I don't I don't trust these spooky weapons. The entries are always the same. <laughs> Nothing useful. Still has that sweater. What the fuck game? I decided to follow in your footsteps. I would erase myself from existence. But as I left this mortal coil, I started to feel apprehensive. If you don't have a soul, what happens when you Something primal started to burn inside me. No, I thought. I don't want to die. Then I woke up. Like it was all just a bad dream. I was back at the garden. Back at my save point. At first, I used my powers for good. I became friends with everyone. I solved all their problems flawlessly. Their companionship was amusing for a while. As time repeated, people proved themselves predictable. What would this person say if I gave them this? What would they do if I said... <sighs> This this game does does meta better than any other game I've ever played. It is fuck man. Once you know the answer, that's it. That's all they are. Holy shit, it does meta better than any other game. It all started because I was curious, curious what would happen if I killed them. I don't like this, I told myself. I'm just doing this because I have to know what happens. Ha ha ha. What an excuse. You of all people must know how liberating it is to act this way. At least we're better than those sickos that stand around and watch it happen. Those pathetic people that want to see it, but are too weak to do it themselves. I bet someone like that is... I bet someone like that's watching right now, aren't they? Are they, chat? I've done everything this world has to offer. I've read every book. 
I've burned every book. I've won every game. I've lost every game. I've appeased everyone. I've killed everyone. Sets of numbers, lines of dialogue, I've seen them all. But you, you're different. I never could predict you, Waffle. I'm tired of being a flower. Waffle, there's just one thing left I want to do. Let's finish what we started. Let's free everyone. I like Flowey. Creatures like us wouldn't hesitate to kill each other if we got in each other's way. So that's... So that's... Why? Ha, ha. What's this feeling? Why am I shaking? Hey, Waffle. No hard feelings about back then, right? Hey, hey. What are you doing? But back off. What about Flowey? What about Flowey? Oh, shit. All right. Hey, uh, you've been busy, huh? So, I've got a question for you. Do you think even the worst person can change? That everybody can be a good person if they just try? <laughs> All right. Well, here's a better question. Do you want to have a bad time? Because if you take another step forward, you are really not going to like what happens next. Well, sorry, old lady. This is why I never make promises. It's a beautiful day outside. Birds are singing. Flowers are blooming. On days like these, kids like you should be burning in hell. What the fuck game? What the fuck game? What the fuck game? Our fate rests upon you. Waffle, stay determined. What the fuck game? What the fuck was that? What the fuck did you just do to me game? Are you fucking real? What? <laughs> hey, uh, you look frustrated about something. Guess I'm pretty good at my job, huh? Okay, so he slams you down. It's a beautiful day outside. Birds are singing. Flowers are blooming. On days like these, kids like you should be burning in hell. Okay, so he slams down to so go right up. Okay, then down, then in the middle, then to the side, in the middle, to the down. Huh? Always wondered why people never use their strongest attack first. <laughs> You're like, you have a bad time. You eat the legendary hero, attack increased by four, you recover four HP. What is this music? Holy fuck the music, what, what is? What? You think I'm just gonna stand there and take it? Our fate rests upon you, Waffle. Stay determined. <sighs> well, Undertale, we had a good run. We had a good run, Undertale. I haven't even damaged him. What the fuck? Okay. Uh, hmm, that expression. That's the expression of someone who's died twice in a row. Suffice to say, you look really unsatisfied. All right, how about we make it a third? Am I supposed to die? It's a beautiful day outside. Are we really gonna do this every time, Sans? Okay, he skipped it this time. To the side, to the middle, down below. Okay. What is what is the purple? Anyways, as I was saying, it's a nice day out. Why not relax and take a load off? Shit. Shit. Well, the music's really good. I wish I could hear more than 10 fucking seconds of it. Hmm, that expression. That's the expression someone's died thrice in a row. Hey, what comes after thrice anyway? Wanna help me find out? Does it need, does it need to be perfect? Our report showed a massive anomaly in the time space continuum. Timeline's jumping left and right, stopping and starting. What the fuck is this? Oh. You piece of shit game. Oh my god, the music is so good. What the fuck? Fuck! Until suddenly everything ends. Undertale becomes Mario. 
<clears throat> what the fuck? That expression. That's the expression of someone who's died twice in a row. Twice? Thrice? Well, won't have to use it again anyways. <sighs> What's check? Sans one attack, one defense. The easiest enemy can only deal one damage. You piece of shit liar. Wow, it's even smaller now. Fuck, man. Fuck, that's tough. Until suddenly, everything ends. Okay, so he only talks when I, when I attack him. Miss. <laughs> that's your fault, isn't it? What? Holy shit. You can't understand how this feels. Knowing that one day, without any warning, it's all going to be reset. Look, I gave up trying to go back a long time ago. Do, 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 do. And Game to the Surface doesn't really appeal anymore either. Okay, this, this is the best music in the whole game. I can't believe that we're hearing the best music this late into the game. This is the best music in the whole game, because even if we do, we'll just end up right back here without any memory of it, right? To be blunt, it makes it kind of hard to give it my all. Or is that just a poor excuse for being lazy? Hell if I know. All I know is seeing what comes next. I can't afford not to care anymore. We're gonna die. 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 We didn't die. Ugh. That being said, you uh really like swinging that thing around, huh? Listen, I know you didn't answer me before, but somewhere in there, I can feel it. There's a glimmer of a good person inside of you. The memory of someone who once wanted to do the right thing. Someone who, in another time, might have even been a friend. Come on, buddy. Do you remember me? Please, if you're listening, let's forget all this, okay? Just lay down your weapon, and, well, my job will be a lot easier. Sans is sparing you. Well, it was worth a shot. Guess you like doing things the hard way, huh? <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. Hmm. That expression. That's the expression of someone who's died five times in a row. Convenient, huh? That's one for each finger. But soon, you'll need a cool mutant hand to count all of your deaths. Did they do it like this so you can't invincible in, in, in iframe through a lot of the attacks? Like it's when you get hit, it, it, it does this building purple thing on you instead. Okay, here we go again. Okay, so we want to attack him and he's gonna do this weird fucking thing. Well, is it worth a shot? What the fuck did damage to me there? Sound changed before all this, I was secretly hoping we could be friends. I always thought the anomaly was doing this because they were unhappy, and when they got what they wanted, they would stop with all this. What the fuck is doing damage to me? What the fuck? What? 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 Let's hit him. We're gonna be here all fucking day. Maybe all they need was, I don't know, some good food, some bad laughs, some nice friends. Oh, we're gonna be here all day. What the fuck? <laughs> That's the expression of someone who's died six times in a row. That's the number of... That's the number of fingers on a mutant hand, but soon you'll need to find a mutant hand with even more fingers. I love how it gives you this super powered fucking knife and, and, uh, and, and dagger before this. Here are some really cool weapons. Shit, we have the dog salad. Oh no. It re- 2 HP? Curse you dog salad. Fucking curse you dog salad. You fucking- Okay, so you can't you can't move the fight cursor up while the bones up there. You need to time that too. That's what's doing damage to me when the heart cursor goes up. Oh, what the fuck in the bottom? What the fuck? That's ridiculous, right? Yeah, you're the type of person who won't ever be happy. We're gonna die. 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 We didn't die. You'll keep consuming timelines over and over until, well, hey, take it from me, kid. Someday, you gotta learn when to quit.
What? I'm gonna taste today. <sighs> You're making me hate you, Sans. You're making me hate you. You're fucking bullshit. Okay, I just wanna die and restart. I just wanna die and restart after that. That was terrible. That was terrible. That was awful. That was just fucking terrible. Yeah, 30 HP. Thanks a lot, dog fucking salad. What happens if you use food after he does- he goes into his sweat phase? Like when he says he's sparing you? What happens if you use food? Oh, so we get to- we get to fully heal here. For free. Okay, well shit. Yep. Yep. Totally, totally justified, totally justified. That expression, that's the expression of someone who's died nine, so, no. Nope, wait, that's definitely nine, sorry. Or was it 10? Dog salad, what are you gonna give me? 10? No one likes you, dog salad. Cause you see, all this fighting is really tiring me out. What? I jumped. What? I jumped. I wonder how many hits away he was from being done. One, 17. That's just, just, just real good job there, Joe. You're really showing Sans who's boss there. Great, just eat, eat, eating bones right on the first attack. Just really, really fantastic job. What? And if you keep pushing me, then I'll just force use my special attack. This isn't your special attack? We haven't seen the special attack yet? Yeah, my special attack. Sound familiar? Well, get ready, because after the next move, I'm going to use it. So if you don't want to see it, now is a good time to die. Well, we're going to die anyway, don't worry. Okay, what's the special attack? Well, here goes nothing. Are you ready? I'm really not. Survive this, and I'll show you my special... <sighs> what? How? 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 Oh, man. I don't know if I can do this. I don't know if I can do this. Yeah, we died. Yep. I don't know. I can't I, I can't remember last time I felt like I was up against a brick wall like this in, in, in bosses. Even, even Neo, after a few tries, or maybe less time than I spent on, on Sans now, uh, usually it feels like it's starting to come together, but that phase two is just, holy shit, there's just too many attacks that are just, yeah, I'm just, I'm just eating them. Yeah, we got hit. We got hit. And just think, after this, I get to go see my kids for a bit, have some breakfast. But after that, I get to play Super Mario Sunshine. Oh boy, what a what a beautiful day. I get get my ass kicked by my best friend in Undertale, and then I get to play Super Mario fucking Sunshine. Fuck with the bone and the fucking main man. It, shit. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. Just kill me. Just die. Just kill me. 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 Kill me. Just kill me. Yep. There we go. Or maybe I'm just not. Yeah. Just being like it's phase one who gives a shit and you can't just be it's phase one who gives a shit. Okay. You can't dodge it. Okay. And then I get hit by the whole thing in the fucking skeleton room and all these lasers. All these lasers just hit me. Every single laser hit me because I was too busy thinking, oh yeah, you can ju you can jump the bones. What? Okay, fuck off, Undertale. Fuck off, Undertale. Fuck off, Undertale. Are you fucking serious? Are you fucking serious, Undertale? Fuck off, Undertale. Really? That's at the end. Is that even the end? You're 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 you're, you're sending me f through fucking Gladius. Really? You're sending me through the all all of a sudden with no fucking warning. You're sending me through the Gladius fucking tunnel. Really? If we get through this, we'll heal. No, we didn't. Okay, let's just die. Let's just die. Yeah. Okay. What?
What? What? What? What? What? What? What? What? What? What? What? What? What? What? What? What? What? What? Please be the end. Is it gonna be one more attack? Another fuck you attack? Please be done. For the love of Christ, please be done. Huff puff. All right, that's it. It's time for my special attack. <laughs> Are you ready? Here goes nothing. Yep. That's right. It's literally nothing. And it's not going to be anything either. Hey, hey, hey. You get it? I know I can't beat you. One of your turns, you're just going to kill me. So, uh, I've decided it's not going to be your turn ever. I'm just going to keep having my turn until you give up. Even if it means we have to stand here until the end of time. Capiche? Okay, I want to take my hand off the keyboard. But I'm afraid he's going to do some last fucking little shitty attack and I'm gonna put my fist through the monitor <laughs> you'll get bored here if you haven't gotten bored already I mean and then you'll finally quit oh wow my fingers hurt holy shit he's falling asleep can we sneak off to left now oh okay oh shit can we move to item first I would much prefer if we went to item first oh for fucks oh Okay, we got it. Okay. So, guess that's it, huh? Just... Okay, I just want to put something in perspective there. Moving that white box across down there made me more tense and scared than I have ever felt in any horror game in my entire life because I was afraid he was going to wake up and kill me and I have to do the whole fight again. No game has ever... No horror game has ever made me feel as tense and scared as I just was now creeping that fucking white box down to, down to fight. That was one of the hardest bosses I've ever had to beat. He was ridiculous. Why not settle this over a nice cup of tea? Holy shit. Why you? See, I never betrayed you. It was all a trick, see? I was waiting to kill him for you. After all, it's me, your best friend. I'm helpful. I can be useful to you. I promise I won't get in your way. I can help. I can. I can. Please don't kill me. What? Greetings. I am Waffle. Your power awakened me from death. With your guidance, I realized the purpose of my reincarnation. Power, let us erase this pointless world and move on to the next. Erase, do not. Okay, I want to erase. I want to go with it. Yep. Right. You are a great partner. We'll be together forever. Won't we? What the fuck? Cool. That was neat. So I don't know if that showed up on stream, but it made it made the game go into windowed mode. It, it knocked it right off full screen and it bounced around the monitor for a little while. And that was the end. All right. Uh, cool. All right. Did the game delete itself completely? Is, is there's, there's no more loops, there's nothing. I think that genocide was really fun and I think that it was a really cool idea and it's pretty much cemented Undertale as one of my favorite games. I, I, really, I really enjoyed this game a lot. And um, I don't think it's flawless. I don't think that it's it, it's it's too. I have to think about it before I call it masterpiece or anything like that. It, it seems like it has all the right credentials for it. Um, but this is one of my favorite games, and um, if only because it does so many things that I've wanted games to do for a while. That your choices matter. That your choices are not always given to you in a very hey you have to make a choice. 
Um, it reacts to you. The meta stuff that it was going on is probably, I said earlier, it was probably the best meta experience I've ever seen done in a game, but it's probably the best meta experience I've ever seen done, period. It was, it was so good. The, the, the way that it, it toys with what you're doing and, and you know, I, I, I think that maybe that was the right way to play it even, that, that going that going neutral and pacifist and genocide there's 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 something there's some weight to it that's given over to i've already done this and now i'm just you know i'm here for fun just killing everyone just because i can and the game calls you on that you know what i mean it was it was really good and i'm curious and i'll never know i'll never ever be able to have the first playthrough again of going genocide first and then the other ones i'll never know right i'll never get that i'll never know but i i, I kind of feel like imagining it i kind of feel like this was the best way to do it favorite ending is probably um i don't know all all all, all the bosses are good all like flow flowey's fight is so oh my god what's even happening and i think that might be my favorite because it just came out of nowhere but the pacifist fight at the end is has such great music and it's it's okay and sans's fight is such great music and it's and it's unfair it's like it's like the game, it's it's like a boss fight that is an experience and you have to perform at the same time. It's testing you on what you can do, but it's like the game is, is saying to you, we're going to be, I think it's unfair. I, I think I think it's an unfair fight and I think it's unfair because this is the game struggling against you. We're not going to go down. We're going to try everything we can do to, 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 to not let you win, you know? It's, it's just so, it's just such powerful thing you know like it's such it's such a that, that's such a cool idea i don't know which ending i like i, I it's kind of all wrapped into one for me right now i think i think i'm gonna have to talk about this game it's gonna come bursting out of me at some point so that was good